got uh, who's not signed up yet? Oh, Callian, have anyone signed in? Hello, Brian. Hello, who's that? Uh, I don't know. What <laughs> Hello. Well, you don't recognize the voice. Oh, hey, Biggie, how's it doing? <laughs> right. from, uh, Biggest cheesels. Yeah, he is. Le, le Grande Cheesy. Um, well, Hellions have signed in now. Okay, we've got one team still waiting to sign in. Isaac never dies. Floxy. I can't ping them. So we've got teams today. There is. She's starting. I don't know if I want to start blabbering about stuff and before we've actually started on the street. <laughs> well, it's nice for you to join us, Biggie, by the way. Um, so well. I haven't been through for this. I see the announcement but I'm like, I can't make this. Hmm? I usually see the announcement of this, and but I can never make it. Oh, well, you're lucky today, I guess. Mm. Freeze will be coming along in a bit. Uh, Matthew has his dinner. <laughs> dinner, oh, yeah. So, that's where he's come around. Oh, sorry, I'm just having a drink. Uh, uh, quick question. Um, the new hero, does his uh, full book work on, ex uh, work on externals? Yeah, yeah. So the oh, so it stops chains basically. Yeah, yeah, it's quite good for that. Um, I mean, it depends. Oh, so you mean uh, on attacks that are not targeted to the guy? Yeah. Okay, so that depends on whether the character that's throwing the attack has off-target enhanced lights or enhanced attacks. Some characters don't bounce off external superior guards, and some do, and it, it's uh, it's really uh, inconsistent. But you can find it in the info hub. Oh, uh, right. that will. Like it's listed on per character per character basis. Characters like JJ and Black Briar, they will bounce. It was off. about Black Briar because I was thinking, could he like bait out an ex like a full block attack, then just flip it? Uh, well, Black Briar bounces, so no one. Then, but um, against like so you can't if you're playing Hitakiri, you can Hitakiri doesn't bounce on external full blocks, so you can hit them externally with a heavy and then trade with the oh. their follow up. Pretty crazy. Um, and can JJ see through it? Uh, no, JJ bounces as well. Oh, yeah. The only two here of the fleet. I know, right? Um, I mean, JJ could see through it from a zone because his zones won't bounce because uh, the zone has zone properties. It wouldn't because it's, it's unblockable, would it? No. Or neutral zone? Are you it's neutral zone, yeah, yeah. See through oh. it, through, of course. Um, well, the bracket is about to go live. The teams we have today, which are probably ones to watch, we're going to be watching the Nam Gloria matches, and the extra cool Gatchias, and probably the Hellions. Oh, and Inconsistus and Hellions. Those are the teams to look after, out for. I might just check if I haven't got any of those hells been through in my friends list. Spectate them. Um, and then I think I've got another monkey. So good. But how the moth? So filthy. I'm just uh, curious about something before I go. Yes. Uh, it's about the bashes in general being 500 ms. Mm -hmm. Like in most generally, I don't really consistently can react to them. But in my opinion, they feel like slow. But I like get bashed by it often. Well, they have a syringe MS startup, so they can be quite hard to. Um, so well, they, they, they I know they, all they, bashes, but they, I know all bashes are not equal. For example, like the Kyoshin, like yeah, he has to go like three hundred MS into it before he can bash. Yeah, unlike a uh, conqueror or a black prior. I think, like they can go 100 ms in the bash. Uh, they have variable timings, basically. Yeah, yeah. Which makes their bashes uh, uh, unbelievably oppressive. I mean, oppressive isn't necessarily the right, right word, but um, you know, they're good. They're better at defense. They're better defensively than. Um... Sorry, I'm just, I'm just trying to work out who I've got. On my friends list so we can uh, defensively it. what do you mean in that in, term they're better for they're better for interrupts when they have sh shorter startup because then but, they um they want well, to start up earlier you can you can interrupt things quicker with them 
Right, the bracket is now live, so let's have a look at this. I, uh, all right, thank you for answering the question. I'll be going. Oh, all right, all right. It'll be in an hour to come watch with y'all if you're, it's still on. Yeah, hopefully it will be. All right, take care. You too. All right, let's share this. I can put, I'll, put, I'll put the brackets up whilst we're waiting, I guess. Right. Let, me see. Let me know if that is uh, showing up. Is that, are you seeing the brackets? Yeah, yeah. Okay, cool, cool, cool. We have Inconsistence versus Al Modavaz and the Hellions versus Extra Cool Gatches. This one probably is the one to watch. Um, so, yeah, we'll... Watch, watch that one. I won't, I won't be strict sharing the bracket screen all the time because I can, as a like an admin on the tournament, I can actually click in and see the chat and stuff, which is probably not what I want to show everybody. Um, but I'll, so I'll, I'll stop doing that soon. But um, uh, are you seeing it, Stag? Yeah, okay. and I put it up on stream. The brackets are okay. visible there. Maybe I just maybe it's the stream is just at the time like the mm -hmm. Twitch page just me is lagging. Oh, oh, there he goes. Okay. Wait. Oh, oh, mine? Is that showing my screen? Oh, weird. What do you mean? Oh. I don't know. Mm. Anyway, um, yeah, I'll just switch over to sharing the game anyway. So. Mm. Let me Hola. turn your stream. Hello. Put that in touch. Hello. Small children. How many people we got in the chat today? Uh, uh, what is uh, BP's chain bash? What speed is it again? Is it five? Yeah, it's five hundred MS. Yeah, it, it's the same as. And the recovery is probably z it's pretty much zero. It's it's got six hundred MS recoveries to everything. Um, it's the same as. Sorry, it's allowed. Um, it's okay. So can any dodge attack punish it? Uh, some of the faster ones can. Yeah. Sorry, let me just mm. change the headphones because there's a bunch of racket in the background. Can't hear what to say. All right, so yeah, most uh, many fast dodge attacks can punish it, but the slower ones like um, uh, what's his face, JJ and JJ obviously can't. Um, <laughs> I think JJ can punish it with Sifu into the unblockable, the unblockable zone. Code. I think you probably could do that now. Yeah, I think you can. I'm not I'm not 100 percent sure. I mean, it depends, it depends how early but it sorry. goes. Um, because I've been able to dodge, uh, so a warden's tried to punish a bash. I've been able to dodge it, which is yeah. Ooh. That would normally punish it if they buffer it, but maybe they like st partially maybe charge later. it. If they partially charge it, then it won't. They won't be able to. Uh, oh, so you have to buff. It. Yeah, I mean, it's it's one of these weird ones. Okay. Ooh. Enjoying looking at some of the match banter. How are you, five hundred and twenty-nine? <laughs> uh, just been playing for a long ass time. So that's what happens when you have a lot of experience of being really bad at the game. <laughs> right, so these are the areas we're looking for the eyes on. Uh, I mean, like like every for honor a tournament, there'll be a lot of time sitting around waiting for eyes to appear, but. I would be able like to tell you the. What? Are you talking about the spectating? Yes, yes. I'm just like mentioning to people in the. So anybody who wants to join us in the. Chat oh, yeah. What? Oh no! I was just thinking if I knew any of these people. Um, these guys, the Helvigan crew, they're from uh, Extra Cool Gatchias, which I think will be the first uh... game. Pardon, the first game we're looking for. The other one will be Rod Inconsistence is playing Al Mogavars, but I think that will be less exciting than this this match. So we're going to go. Oh with that. wow! Um, not not to uh, cast aspersions on the um, uh, on the Al Mogavars or Al Mogavars, oh. but um, uh, Inconsistence quite have a quite a good team. And I mm. think it's probably more close and more interesting to watch. How are um, y'all doing today? Hello, I'm doing all right. So I need to keep need to keep on going back to Discord so I can see who's talking. Um, small chilling, right? Hello. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's no overlay, is there? On I've turned it off, so 
so ah. I don't stream it back. I mean, I could try turning it on again. I just had a bit. I had really bad performance with it the other day, so it does just. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I'll, I'll try it again. Maybe I'll. You know, it's not even. <laughs> uh, it's not even that. Of course, now it's not showing in the game because it's not. I haven't over uh, started the overlay beforehand. Doesn't really matter. Yeah, you have to restart. That's just long. Yeah, can't bother with that. Mm -hmm. Especially when we got eyes to be looking for. These ones. Um, yeah. So, oh yeah, map order. I can tell you that. So we have the first match. Map is going to be Citadel Gate, and oh. then Sanctuary Bridge, mm -hmm. <laughs> and then um, Harbour goes with Tarbrick. Oh, I thought there was going to be at least High Fort. <laughs> no, High Fort was banned. Oh, um, is it banned? Yeah. So, well, not banned in the map. Uh, red pool but but the way that the the, the um maps work in in best of threes is that the higher seed team gets to pick a map that they banner play, map. So they can the banner map then the lower seed team bans a map and then uh then it goes pick ban pick ban and the the team that didn't pick the map gets to choose the side so uh of the available maps uh, and then when it comes best of five it goes instead there's uh the the top the high team can the lower seed bans a map, and then the higher team picks. Because that, well, I think it was originally it was set up so there wasn't enough because there weren't enough maps for a. There were only six, but I think now we've got more enough in the enough available, which can't. To be able to ban. That we should, they could have two bans, but I don't think the rule set has been ref changed to reflect that. Because we have High Fort, Overwatch, Sanctuary Bridge, Temple Gardens, this is our Gate, Harbor, and Beachhead. Yes, that's seven. Nobody likes playing on high <laughs> Well, yeah, nobody does like it playing. Nobody likes getting edged immediately. So, um, I hope they make sure they've got their spectator mode enabled. This is often a. I mean, they should do it. Oh, there we go. We have eyes. All right. So I don't know how far, how long this the Twitch stream is lagging behind, but is how's the Discord thing looking? By the way, we've got not a huge number of people in chat, so it's all looking smooth. Nice. Very fun. Mm -hmm. so Sorry, you too. Alright. I'm glad. Oh, only one Shigoki. Oh, yeah, it looks like the Halvin crew are not running a Shigoki, which is interesting. Uh, so we have. Thanks. Pardon? Just to double check, single pick is enforced in competitive. Yes, of course. Yeah, so, yeah, so the rules are perfect. single pick and no perks and certain feats are banned, so no smoke bomb and no Puji. And you can't have duplicate tier four feats. So we help them through the uh, uh, you can... you sure that perks are switched off. It's just an option customer. in the menu uh, in custom games. Alright, so we have, I guess, the, the comps are a very meta comp um, using Shigoki, and then the Helvigan guys aren't aren't running Shigoki, which is uh, very very controversial at the moment because, well, Hel uh, Shigoki is considered oops, turn off, hold on, um, considered very mandatory. Powerful. So we have starting rotations as per usual. Is it because the bash makes it? Mandatory. I mean, he's just, he's got lots of different things that make him extremely good. Um, That's one of the best feats. Let me go up there to. I saw I saw him running off the side. Um, so his bash is obviously giving him a lot of safety in team fights and is very strong. Um, uh, unblockable. The big unblockables with hyper armor. He has Demon Ball, which is an excellent ganking tool. Oh, yeah. Super armor. Uh, he has uh, super armor. I mean, if you if you land a demon ball with allies around, you're pretty much guaranteed to kill them, um, or at least land two or two heavies. Um, but there goes Moki. But of course, you do get punished for it as well, which will happen to Bill oh, yeah, just then. As well. Lucifer pushing to stall the heal. If anybody um, followed us on the last dojo, we talked about the, when is a good time to push, and when the when the opponents are on low health is a good time to push. So actually, I think this is would be considered quite a good time to push. And there we go. Nice gank there. And they, oh, they don't manage to get it off before they get the rotation on. Um, Stalor on the Black Prior. 
Helvagon Baron is going to push a back cap. I don't think he's going to get there in time before Bill New shows up. We'll um, see how this one, this fight plays out before, before going to look at that. Bill New's very... Wow, Bill News. Oh, let's have a look at this, actually. It's gonna... He's eating so much damage from the Goki, uh, from, the, from the Gladiator, who then yes, <laughs> manages to get away. Very well played by Baron. And they their push to A failed, so that's going to be a lot of defender renown fed to the Helvgen boys. Uh, Moki and Clore were there, I think. Um, so let's go back to the mid fight in that case. Carrot on a lot of revenge, so if he gets another tag, he'll be popping that revenge. But if he eats a bunch of external on attacks, he won't be he won't be getting anything. Um, <laughs> Oh, there we go. Down he goes. Well played from Clory. Using the buff, which gives you damage buff based on the number of enemies around. So that would be, I think, a 15% damage buff with two enemies around. This should be a very... There we go. He get ganks himself by putting himself in recovery. This is looking like a very strong starting position for um, health and crew. Hey there, how's it going? Nice Hello. to play there. Mistimed that guard brink. Let's move again. Sorry if I just um, over again. So see who's. Oh, it's uh, Zazumi. How are you doing? I'm fun. And you? I'm doing all right. Baron looking really good here. He's in his dangerous position, but he's not got anybody. Oh, there we go. I was about to say he's not got anybody with a bash to, to ledge, but then he went and put himself in recovery. So, really good guard break from Carry it there for turning that. If you're heavy, would it still connect? Pardon? If after toe stab, can you throw heavy? You can throw heavy, yeah, but if you... There's always between chain links, and I don't think he... He either didn't throw it out fast enough, or he... Um, I mean, they, they landed the, the guard break perfectly timed. He's again going for another back cap, and he'll get there on time as well. Up he goes. He's doing... I mean, that's probably sensible, because it's going to pull these guys away back to contest that gap, back cap. Who will they... I'm not sure who they're going to send there. Still all gets... Push into the fire, unfortunate. Gives um, Homka a real good opportunity to go and go and heal because they're going to have to go and deal with this back cap. Oh, uh, Lucifer's gone up to push again in in reverse. <laughs> they <just kept laughs> again, they've, trade, they've traded home points. Interesting. Uh, whoever comes off the spawn from the attackers will probably go back to catch their home point. Bill is going to bleed out. Oh, that was really bad, yeah. giving him revenge then. That is really... That's not what you want. And how he's got a free rotation off to go and heal. Ooh. Nice parry from Carrot. Oh, this 1v1 goes. Um, and now they're in a very strong position on the enemy's home point in order to... Unfortunate. That bash then just got hit by the zone. No chase on Black Prior. <laughs> oh. And that should be dead. No. no. Oh, he has a little bit of health left. Oh, oh, oh I does have chase. For one year. For one year. It, work. <laughs> it happens every now, every now and again. It happens. Yep. Uh, good sinister oh. shield there. Needed because, uh, I mean, if they can get kills here, they get defender around. Um, mm. Salor's come into. There we go. Oh, yeah. And that's and that's 20 renown for every play, player on the attackers on this point. And going to be. Oh, missed time the guard break. Wait, that he works like that? I thought it was just like uh, I thought the renown bonus was only for the killer. No, no, it's for that's what's so powerful oh, about geez. it. Just everybody oh, wow. who's on the point. Um, okay. Yeah. So they all got um, twenty renown. That was that was I say a, a big misplay from these guys because they they really fucked up killing uh, this Jan yeah. who was yeah. would have been dead if they'd guard broken, but instead they went for a light attack to confirm that unblockable and actually now ending up triple capped. Helgen Baron. Presumably one is one v one here before. See his kills, four kills. Uh, um. Nice, <laughs> nicely done. That should be no missed time that heavy. Ah, oh, missed time the guard break. Look how much revenge on this man. That's unfortunate. A bit of pra that's a case of practice there. Oh, they're breaking. They're breaking now. They really need to get this point back. Carrot is is getting thirsty, but he's also being pushed towards. Pulled towards the edge, which Baron obviously yeah. is trying to to do. 
And they should really probably be fo letting... Oh, nice, but almost carry. He's, he's, ex he's probably being externally blocked. Oh. There we go. Nicely done. Um, and Moki's got Jug. This should be... I mean, he'll probably get revenge before they get the down. Oh, and they fucked that up as well. God, that's real bad. Um, no. Yeah, that... Uh, I mean, you got to land those heavies off a of Goki Ganks. Extra 10 seconds of... That should be... No Goki should have guard broken for that unblockable. That's just... I mean, it's just poor communication, really. Um, Lucifer goes down. There's somebody dead on mid already. Homka's got Burt feats and they got health advantages looking like ggs for yes yeah. for hellions oh yeah, yeah. And <laughs> <not far. laughs> sank comes out uh sorry sank um phalanx comes out from oh it's phalanx from the jj yeah oh, well, there's no they haven't sorry. got a bp but the <laughs> oh got a team that was really strange yeah yeah he got killed by um i make her i think hey maker yeah and then he was doing like the death <laughs> animation whilst be whilst falling off. Uh, <laughs> quite enjoyed that actually. <laughs> it's pretty fun, yeah. That was, quite that was fun. a quick match. That was a, that was a quick match. Seven minutes, not the fastest, yeah. but I mean, uh, they had some good pushes. Uh, these guys, as we talked about last time, good time to push when you have enemies all in low health. Um, they did well to uh, try and take the pressure off by put, forcing that. Like swap by trading home points, but they they just need more practice to not mess up those ganks because um, you know that cost them uh, the points in in two different occasions where they could have had guaranteed kills and defender renown if they had had properly confirmed those attacks, but they didn't. So just a, just a matter of practice, and I hope they I hope they uh, stick it out and carry on practicing because they've definitely got potential. These guys. Um, I'm surprised they let the glad back up so many times. Uh, hey there, Tetsuo. Yes, they do need to have somebody watching to, you know, take care of the, those back gaps. And I think the Glad was also quite played very well. Managed to anti gank on a couple of occasions, or at least partially anti gank, and until he get until he gets a rotation. I think he won a one v one or two as well, which is, you know, something. Obviously, you not really much you can do. Uh, you, know, you, you either win one v ones or don't. But you tend to want to send somebody there to gank, so you don't have to have that, you know. It drags on. Risk of losing, yeah. Um, okay, so they'll, their next map. What did I say it was? I already, I already mentioned it, but I've now forgotten what I said it was. Yeah, it was um, Citadel. No, it wasn't that. That was you just had Citadel. It's Sank Bridge, and I have sorry, yeah. a dispute already. Exciting. Let's have a look at this. A rave dispute and, and what's going on? <clears throat> um, just go and I'll pick that up in a second. I just need to go and mention this to the danger people. Um, so again, being partially working, doing admin stuff on this. Um, Hopefully somebody will sort that out whilst I get on spectating this one. Keep my eye on it. Um, so yes, this is best of three. So if the Helvland guys win this one, they will be pushing um, Hellions, which is carry carries and um, Lucifer's team down into the loser's bracket. If they can pull it off. Oh, it's still early one to go. Yeah, I mean they 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 won with their comp, so presumably they're going to stick with oh, it. Oh yeah, it was other way around. <laughs> yeah, um, yeah, it was like a break. Although key, having though. said that, the uh, carries team has changed their comp. They've come, they've they, they they've pulled off uh, the berserk and they swapped out for JJ and carry Kara or Carrot um, fridge claws is another name is on Nagoki now. So let's see how this is going. Second. So everyone pretty much has a big hitbox then. On the... Yeah, so this is a um You know, this is uh I guess you'd it was quite a meta comp. Um 
So people, every, almost every team is running JJ, Zhenhu, and Goki, and then the, the fourth is is either war, normally Warlord, but can be Gladiator, Berserker, or Black Prior in this case. So Did they not use Scent anymore. No Scent. Scent's gank is very good, but he is just bad everywhere else. Uh, oh, that's through no defensive play. Yeah, and he and it's a very strongly team fight focused meta at the moment. Um, so he he sent sent us so badly in team fights, especially against big. Um, yeah, there's no right? right? Yeah, he has nothing yeah. he can do against off target um, UBs, and that means that he is very vulnerable. So here, health totals looking kind of even. Oh no, actually looking very much in favour of suddenly in favour of the health and crew. Lucifer goes to peel. Bill News there in in low low health. Um, I don't think they'll probably go for a push now because that puts them that will definitely be probably an overextension and they'll probably they'll probably head back to go heal after Helgen gets that the Clory gets that execution. So we just see what's um, is going on. I've got my dispute here. Span, you paused again. Yeah, I know. I have. I'm just looking. At, um, I've got to to look at some dispute things as well. Um, so I'm just wondering, is Kensei still a good pick for? I mean, he's not or... a bad pick. He's just not meta at the moment. Oh, okay, yeah. Let's have a look at ba Baron. Has pushed onto their home point with a health advantage and a good gank pair. JJ and Goki is very, very scary to be ganked by. We will see if they can. Oh no, mess that one up. We'll see if they <laughs> mess up again. Oh dear. Bill New looks like he's had enough and is running away from things. He's going to let more be won. Helvigan Baron is... Helvigan, uh, what's he? Uh, Hompker is showing up to help contest. I mean, that was not great. Let's put it that way. I mean, they finally killed Baron, but... Um, oh, sorry, I messed up. The, um, well, they did actually manage to come in and get those kills, so they, they will have a good amount of defender renown from that, but it's not... Uh, I mean, that was still much slower than, the, than it ought to have been. So I'm just going to put this back to this view whilst I switch out to look at this. All right. Now, Helvigan... Go These guys are going for a push on Helvigan's home points. Um... They need build one or build new or style needs to get up here quick because this is going to look, this is going to go badly for these guys if they don't get um, back up quickly. I think. Let's have a look. Salor and build new ganking Helvigan Homka there, which is I think a bad decision. They should be sending one of them. Up. Oh, Helvigan Homka even actually gets a kill, gets a ledge kill on build new. So yeah, uh, both of them go down on point. Yeah, that is really bad. They're going to have a massive renowned lead now. Yep. There we go. Well, actually, not well. They definitely brought back their renowned, renowned deficit from beforehand. That was a real misplay from Stalor and Vilnu uh, trying to gank Homka off the point. They should have run into, you know, um, one of them should have got a try and pulled out to get their um, runs back. So here we've got another push onto Zone C. Salor extremely low, doesn't have his tier 2 yet, so he can't, and goes down. Nice bit, bit of renown for Baron. All right, we'll see this, if these guys can pull off a good gank quickly, or, okay, no, oh. Doesn't, yeah. <laughs> Manages to mess up a drop attack, unfortunate. Um, Vilnu clipping his ally. Inspire comes mm. out. This is a big damage buff. I mean, they aren't actually doing particularly well in this team fight. There we go. And oh, yeah. um, oof, Baron goes down. Uh, Bilnu dies off point, so it doesn't feed Defender Renown because it is their point now. Lucifer is now stuck in the situation he has to anti gank himself. I <laughs> don't know if they will have a rotation from Stalor to come and fit help yet. Nice. Come on, please forget. And up there, and he goes down to a light attack. Store doesn't get manage to get onto point. This is looking real bad. Um, Karen Bill new coming in. Glory pops his tier three to heal. 
I mean, they need to. They just need to take this point back. There's, not, there's no two ways about it. Oh, Carry gets knocked down by the parry punish. Slaw goes down. Oh. Carry gets a kill before he gets away. Nice. Um, just kind of lands off, big yeah. unblockable. Nice light parry. Now would be it. Oh, he gets no oh, dear. Oh, that's so unfortunate. Oh no. And then he gets a revive. This is looking really, really bad for. Um, Lucy's, Lucifer's crew here, breaking half health on these two, that's one, so look at the top, that's two down, uh, I don't think they'll be able to clear B in time, but... oh they did, nice, well done, um, Carry managed to not get ledged, <laughs> so it's actually a significant achievement, and does a buttload of damage to Helvigamoki, if he can kill him quickly, no, there you go. He's got Pop Fury. That's a uh, big, a big defensive buff. Oh my goodness! If he lands. If he lands attacks now on anybody, he's going to do absolutely huge damage because of his the Fury. fear itself and Fury. I mean, look at look at that headbutt did like fifty damage. And <laughs> uh, Lucy is the only one left, and I don't think he's yeah, going to pull this one yeah. off. If I say so myself, he's got his just his tier one. I mean, like massive, just dis renowned disadvantage. <laughs> yeah, once again, those those are uh, like messed up ganks that we saw with Gokis. That that's gonna gonna cost them. Um, I mean, they just got outplayed here, really. Have a look at the uh, they won without uh, Goki as well. Yeah, same same as last time. Uh, mm -hmm. Yeah, so and it was fast. I mean, it was quite a fast match. But like, I'm gonna quickly check what's going on here. Um, was game two or one? Two. This. Oh, hey there, Norgos. How's it going? This is Hi. game two. So these are uh, that knocks the hell we can go on to the winners bracket. Carry on to the winners bracket, and sorry, do that. And um, Hellions go down to the losers bracket. So this should be. Sorry, this dispute has been resolved. It's okay. Go back to the brackets again. Got the bracket on stream, by the way. Oh, nice, good, good stuff. Um, so, Hello, Hello. oh, hi, Freeze. How's, you, how's it going? Hello. Again, I haven't got the overlay up, so I can't actually see who's joining um, <laughs> when they do. And then I keep on clicking on the wrong servers. So you're, um, you're supposed to just know. Yeah. yeah, I'm supposed to know instantaneously with my yeah. divine powers. I'm fortunately, I'm not one of these. Um, Oh, these guys. Okay, the, so the Inconsistors are playing. Let's have a look at these guys. These they're playing against uh, the Almogavas. And oh, these... I've met these people. They're quite nice. The Almogavas. I uh, know people with cat in their name. Yeah, yeah, that's the Almogavas. Oh, uh, yeah, then, yeah. Catalonian guys, um, and they are playing a second match, which is the Temple Garden. Um, don't know the score from the previous one because they haven't reported it yet. If I were to make an educated guess, I think uh, it's likely that the, Incon the Inconsistors are in the lead. But we'll find out. I think we'll watch this one from the beginning, because looking at the brackets, we have time. I don't think there's going to be... Oh, actually, okay, the score's just been reported. Uh, it is 2-0, so if I watch from the beginning, it'll go from the beginning. Let's, let's instead uh, just skip this one, so sorry about that. Wait, who won? Just came Inconsistors, oh, nice. these guys with the black emblems, have won against these guys, 2-0. Oh. Um, and have are now moving on to play the Extra Cool Gatchas, who are the winners of the previous I actually match. think they will oh. qualify today. The Extra Cool Gatchas? No. Or Inconsistors. Uh, I mean, they're against Nam Gloria as well. Nam Gloria have beaten them in the past. I think yeah. the last tournament they won. Did they win 2-0 against them? Or is it just... Did they? Um, I don't know, I believe in them. You know, I can bring up the bracket for the last one as well, for that matter. Um, let me just do that. And so we're waiting for this one. They need to, like, check up and all that. Um, it's, they've just moved to that. Oh, they've just cat. moved there. Uh, yeah, the cat people got, got um, squished. Two -nilled. They got 2 nilled. What's the... What's the... Catalonian team, right? Yes, they're Catalonian. That's the, well, I'm assuming they are, because that's the colour of the flag. Um, well, damn, there goes my hometown. <laughs> Oh, it's so Batman. which in your hometown in your from Barcelona? Yep. Nice. 
been there, been there several times. Very lo lovely city. Only once. Random thought. I just fixed dark mode. I figured it out, guys. Oh, well done. <laughs> I figured it out, so you won't have to worry about that. <laughs> We're good now. Why not light mode? No. Well, it was, <laughs> no. and it looked terrible. You couldn't, you couldn't read anything on the brackets, but yeah, so... Yeah, the Oof. dark mode on the website did not play well with the dark mode that I had as a browser plugin. Oh, I see. Good now. So last time, actually, Inconsistence didn't play Nam Gloria until the uh, losers' finals, and they lost two 0 at that point. Um, but they did play, uh, and they didn't play the actual gachas either. So we don't know uh, in this next map match, which is. Um, C six. We don't. We don't actually know who is the favored one between inconsistent or Xful Gachias. It could be. It could go either way. Um, for cat people. Uh, the cat people are. Uh, they've they've gone down already. So they're, oh, they're yeah, not bracket. going to lose the bracket. They've gone to lose brackets. Oh, yeah. Oh. So they are against. Going to play against um, the Hellions. The guy who's just the guys who just lost the Healthgun squad in shortly. So we're just waiting on uh, maps. Um, we have a ban for Beachhead from Inconsistus, who are the higher seeded team, um, as they've have had more placements in previous previous um, qualifiers and in previous stages of the series as well. You get to keep points from previous matches, mm -hmm. um, and a ban for High Fort. So we won't be seeing either of those two. Oh, damn it! <laughs> Stag very sad about the la lo la the lack of high four action. <laughs> just want to get you want to get just want to see ledges. Oh, I have a question. You think with Warlord not being such a prevalent pick, people will dare to let high four through, <laughs> or you think that as hmm. soon as high four goes through, everyone will go back to having a warlord on the team? I'm pretty sure. Yeah, if they do allow. I mean, I, I think that's likely actually. Yeah. Uh, yeah, so they actually it... have a a map pick then that a hero specific I mean, map is, pick. On I forty is C the C point that important compared yes. to yeah, it's the primary out. point. Um, I mean, right. I, I don't know. Like Goki can still ledge quite well on that point. Maybe they wouldn't go for it, but I mean, I don't know. I think it's he it just gives such a big advantage on that point. Yeah, that they would be. It's it's a close run thing. Lots of teams are still picking Ward anyway, so I don't think I think it'd be unlikely for a team to risk it and try, just throw pick high four in case the enemy team does pick Ward. Yeah. Like on the other hand, yeah, yeah I mean the uh, yeah, the team that teams that aren't picking Ward will definitely be banning. <laughs> will be banning it, right? Um, I think Inconsistus didn't run a Warlord last time, if I remember correctly. Yeah, they I ran. mean, so you have uh, the scenario where you we just have map bans, we don't have character bans. Mm. So, if you could ban Warlord, I guess maybe you could run High. I like High Fort, that's why I, I like seeing it. I yeah, like playing well. it. But um, yeah, I think it's not happening either. Oh, it's interesting. So this the High Fort was banned by the Helvgun crew, crew, and they are running Warlord. I mean, they all run Warlord, or they have run Warlord, like the last couple of qualifiers, yeah. and you have barely seen. Any high fort in Europe at all, right? No, I don't think it's. I don't think I'm not even sure it's been played a single time. At least in the matches that I've. Yeah. Paid I'm not an A played it, but in the end, it always gets banned. Hates it, yeah. Yeah, nobody wants that. Nobody wants that. So the map's going to be Overwatch, Citadel, and then Temple. If there is a tiebreaker, so let's have a look at the eyes again. I've got Helfgen and Baron. Let me add up. Um, by the way, Freeze, if you want to take over the spectating, if you don't think I'm doing I haven't eaten yet. It. I just <laughs> prepped oh, I see. You know, uh -huh. I'll, I'll leave after this match again, then make <laughs> dinner, eat, and then I will take over from you. Can, yeah, that sounds good to me. relax yeah. then, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what was your, what's your dinner going to be? Chicken wraps. <laughs> Ooh, Classic. that's always a good Classic. one. Wait, is it homemade or is it from... Uh, no, I make it myself. I don't make oh. the wraps myself. I those, but yeah, the rest is homemade. Yeah. Mm. Nice. And here I am Ding. eating my kebab. Kebab. That's that's yeah. a good choice as kebab. well. Um, so <laughs> Cinder's Wolf asked, are 
teams are allowed to play Kyoshin. So note they are not allowed to play Kyoshin in this stage of the Dominion series. You're not allowed to pick. You're not allowed to play characters which have been released during the the current stage of the Dominion series. And because he released mid season instead of uh, the beginning of the season, the series had already started before the Dominion stage two had already started. So he wouldn't be picked. But even if he wasn't banned, which he is, uh, I don't think you'd see yeah, a Kyoshin no. pick. No what? Okay, what is the reason that he's so weak? Um, I mean, predominantly... I mean, we talked about how the meta is currently dominated by characters with really wide oh, yeah, attacks mm. he, and fast bashes. He eats those for breakfast. Um, <laughs> you know, it's, it's an all-you-can-eat unblockable buffet when you're playing Kyoshin. Um he had, I mean, he's got dodge attack, which is all right. It's better that it's gonna. He d- 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 deals with them better than other characters that don't have dodge attacks. Um, but he still his main tools are very vulnerable to it. Um, and he also just has really bad feats. Like, there's no two oh, names about it. Selfish, to be honest. The feats. Are, I mean, the unique feats are selfish. The tier one's pretty good actually. Uh, the tier two is bad. I'd take. I'd say he's probably pick arrow strike in. Um, I do. Does Arrow Strike do 50 or 45 damage? 45 damage. 45. Oh. Yeah. Um, but the tier threes are all just terrible. They're just really bad. I mean, oh, yeah, that's that's even that good. Yeah. I mean, oh, the tier four's all right, but it's not. It's not it's very slow. Yeah. It, you can just see and dodge out of it. Yeah. Um. I. It, it's. It's not the worst tier four in the game. <laughs> but. It, and it's, it's. I think it's all right. I think. You, I think players would, if the character was good, it wouldn't be a tier four that is not means it can't be run. Okay, we've got eyes. All right. I it would have been nice if it left something behind it when it finished, like mm. if it just left traps on the floor or something. Go happy, kind of nutty, wouldn't it? Mm. Imagine. Wait, can you set up with the GB? Pardon? Mm? Can you set it up with a GB? So let's say your teammate yeah. GBs you. Yeah. Technically, but I don't really. Mm. Yeah, but then you're like, I mean, I mean it, it, it hits people who are in recoveries and so on. I mean, it's not bad. It's just not. It's just a bit slow. Yeah, it's just not great. Um, it's got really good synergy with other feats. I mean, like, if Warmonger was still being played, <laughs> like, oh, yeah. people, it would be insane. You, you'd be able to guarantee it off her tier 4 feet um, and then keep everybody in place to get corrupted, which would be nuts. Um Okay, so we have Helgen. You just given me a devious idea. <laughs> <laughs> I do want to see that that done actually. Like, uh, yeah, you, you, what you need to do is basically pop them at the same time, um, and then the hits done from Warmongers should not should cause people to be not be able to dodge the. the what um, about Space Storm? If obviously Hainado wasn't as useless as I mean, yeah, it's, it's good with uh, Fire Flask as well, but like, the hits will knock them out of it. Whereas the damage from, um, damage from. Watch your face from corruption and it doesn't. Oh, yeah, it's ten damage, but yeah, yeah, it, but it doesn't have hit hit reaction, so it won't knock people out. Oh, um, what? Right. So, I mean, the initial the initial one does, but the the second one doesn't. Um, you know what? I actually want to see if uh, Rod and I want to see this one v one if they're gonna try and pull out quick or they're gonna try and stall it out and see what happens to the team fight in the middle because we've seen a lot of we'll see a lot of team team fights. Um, <laughs> bad start for Rod getting a. Uh, GB option selected wow, there. Like, wow. It's another zone. Baron... Oh, there we go. I was about to say, yet to take damage, but then Rod lands too, but... Oh, and doesn't... I don't know, was he trying to bait the guard break there, or trying to bait the parry? Or trying to bait dodge attack, no. but... I'll just just dodge. Miss oh, yeah. That's the danger of the zone option select being unsafe on dodge. Have gonna have taken uh, Mr. Living down in the, the mid-fight, and but the t- overall health total are looking pretty even. Oh and oh, Rod, not not quite dead. <laughs> Can Baron pull it back? That whiffs. Wait, what? what? <laughs> that was. I think he must have been holding backwards because that shouldn't have whiffed. And tries to bait out a, a chase move there. Another GB option select. I would have gone for a light attack to be honest. Um... No, oh, dear. Oh. Well played by Baron. Gets the kill. And how By the way, Ted, who was the first that picked Zerk recently again? I thought it was uh, Rod. Is, is, is he the reason why people try it now? No, and 
Hunt one of the tried in scrims, and then um, everyone else for some reason like just decided to start trying it. I guess because so it's just a random cheap. event again. Yeah. Okay. So whilst Rod lost the one v one on C on A, they did manage to get mid, and now have, Living's got quite. A, I mean, it looks like they've got quite a big feet advantage as well. Um, tier ones for Living and for most of the characters apart from. JJ buff comes out. Big damage there. Look how much damage that did on um yeah. oh, Rod. Look at the chase of the JJ. Uh, was was about to see that. He just wrong. went around. He just went around absolutely flying. Um, Moki getting chunky damage on this key as well. He's going to rotate out to heal. Rod making it work in there. Again, another big big damage. Clory puts himself out of stamina. Not, not a place you want to be. Good parry there. And Rod... I don't know, deflects the wrong way or something. So whilst the point total is not hugely in favour of Inconsistence at this point, the overall renowned total is definitely going their way. Um, yeah, almost double. You trying to bait out a dodge attack? Uh, Marichal oh, goes down. Probably sh shouldn't have a. Uh... Should've done that. I think it just kind of shows how how Zerker just doesn't have as much offense in a team fight because of you know I mean one thing as a bash like he didn't have a lot of offense against JJ and JJ did. He had the yeah. option. Zerker, Sorry, I'm just going to turn your volume up, Norgos, because I can't hear you very well. Sorry about this. Hello. Yeah. Uh, again, see, we're seeing we're seeing the benefit of having. Um, C as a this point because they're able to rotate out and heal repeatedly. Um, Clory pushes there in on his own, which is I think probably a bad push there. He's just seeing a glad gank going out on Marachal who eats skewer and heavy for his for his uh Marachal goes down, leaving Rod to be ganks. He's got a bit of revenge, but unfortunate. Oh. Nice guard break for that. Good peel from his ally. Is it gonna be another another case of being on the one pixel of Baron. No, he does. He does get the kill this time. Uh, maybe not quite as uh, influential as the potential influential yeah. on the overall match outcome. Same difference. Yeah, words. What are they? It's a word, right? Pardon? It is a word. A In, yeah, influential is a word. Yeah, I just. I think I said influential, which is not a word. <laughs> <laughs> um, see how living is doing against. Uh, he's dropped the Mister from his name. I mean, he's do you think he's recently divorced? Mm. Oh, and that's so that's there. We see what oh, yeah. Berserker. What the benefit of Goki and Berserker Sinji is? Berserker can get a lot more damage on Demon Balls than uh, Warlord can because of his extra range on his attacks. Um, so that's partly why people are people are running. Nice deflect there. Is he going to get the? Dodge cancel recovery. How Moki's staying alive, quite impressively. Uh until I said that. What killed him? Really? Uh well, Rod just life stacked him. Was a lot confident. Oh he missed that Oh the... do you see that? <laughs> Is that a top attack? Like, it, uh, yeah, no uh Rod's top attack whiffed somehow, and then Marichal's attack <laughs> bounced off the wall and I mean this is Oh, oh that is a nice anti gank from a uh, Clory. He's probably going to clear mid and try and kill himself. In mm -hmm. fact, they got that a team that here. whole thing to the wall. Yeah, that's basically the wall fucked him, fucked him over. Um, because I th I think his heavy did land, but look, that was a they're going to have a triple cap when mid takes his wealth back. Is that team wipe for ace renown twenty renown for everybody on the team? We're going to see, yeah, renown totals are just really evened out. That's actually re that's really big. Um, so which way are these guys going to push? Is the question now? Not mid. Are they going to push sense, this? and then they wait for people to come if they're coming. If they're coming, I mean, there's not really any reason for them to. No, there's no reason, but you see, there they will. I don't know yeah. why. It's... Uh, Baron will comes in, game. puts himself in a in a gank situation. Where's the other guy got to? Oh no, okay, they're ganking. All right, let's let's have a look at this. I mean, the goal you know, should be to kill the guy, yeah, to kill the Baron here, right? And then um, quickly grab a. Yep, and I think that's. Oh no, Marshall was out, out of stamina. Nice, nicely done though. Um, yeah, I was like, yeah, good, good to bait him out there. This team fight in mid is looking very much in favor of the Helvigans, though. Look, Living's on one pixel. Uh, the other Waller went down. 
Is it their warlord? Um, who's the other player? That's, oh, Just Ice. Who is their JJ? Sorry, not their warlord. Um, but all, all this went pretty well, right? Uh, like they quickly grabbed A yeah, again. They, B they is still being fought. A. They got the kill. Yeah, no, I think it wasn't bad. I mean, I think they probably could, by looks things, probably could have pushed, be pushing C if they had... If just if just I went, I would have sent just I to see off spawn, because he could have got here where these guys are all fairly low health totals. Um, maybe health and Baron went up there as a kind of you know um, distraction. All right, will we see a properly executed Goki gank? No, we will not. Hey, with that one, it's a. Uh... Oh, this is bad. Um, look at the health totals overall. Yeah. Fairly low. This is a dangerous situation for um, Inconsistors. They got managed to get A though, so that's nice. Living is... I think Living might end up dying without even getting to use his tier 4 if he's unlucky. Yep. He didn't get a single... single. No so, you know, Clutch Cation says you never get... You never get... You never get no use out of your tier 4. Well, uh, Living just prove that by not managing to do his namesake. Um, Marichal's not careful, he might die as they break. This kill, will, if he dies, he'll be dying into breaking. And he gets executed, and they're now double capped. This is looking really bad for Inconsistus. Justice gets on the point, <laughs> and gets off the point shortly afterwards. Living, being ganked, he's got no feet. Uh, let's look at Rod. For watching it, uh, get Zerker anti ganks, but oh, as a fear it seems like no plan at all. Yeah, for that last push, fear itself and a glad gank into being very dead. And living is still amazingly alive. Um, did he get he got to kill himself? He actually anti ganked there. We should have watched him. I picked the wrong one to watch. And ah, Pelican Baron gets shot with a longbow. Oh my god, living pulling it off. Uh, until yeah, well, I mean, I, I guess he just gave up then. Uh, yeah. Oh, we should we definitely pick the wrong uh, horse to to back then by watching Rod. I'm sorry about that, Rod. This was a caster's curse, maybe. Um, well played by the Helgen guys. They really managed to keep the momentum going the very end, despite look quite a big renowned disadvantage. Um, I mean, uh, oh no, sorry. I guess they got the tier fours before the end. But yeah, yeah, they they played well then. So the next match is going to be on... What did I say it was going to be on? Temple? Or is Temple the tiebreaker? Uh, Citadel. <laughs> so that was uh, Inconsistence's pick as well. So losing to them on their home turf, as it were. Not necessarily the best portent. We'll see how the next how it goes from here. If you were to give Scent a dodge punch, would that increase his... Viability, yeah. yeah. A dodge punch would be pretty good for Scent, to be honest. Mm -hmm. um, especially if he gets. I, I'm. I think I don't really like love dodge bashes, and I would. And it depends. Well, it depends if it has a GB vulnerability. But presumably, if it was a dodge punch like, um, you go. Uh, <laughs> like well, like Warden's bash, it would have GB Ooh. vulnerability, which means it w wouldn't be great. Again, it'd be vulnerable to external UV uh, phase of guard break. But I don't think Punch has Garbrek vulnerability uh, because it's a chain move. It's only got Hunter Rest. So they, they'd probably have to add a new move to him instead of just linking to Punch. Otherwise, you'd have a Garbrek, a low Garbrek vulnerability attack, which can also be fainted. So I think <laughs> I don't have a problem with that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure, I'm sure uh, Senate wouldn't. I mean, he's still not got a great overall team fighting kit. But he needs a dodge attack as a minimum, basically. Um, what so that would make sense on Scent, though? That isn't completely broken. Um, oh, well, probably a dodge heavy, right? Let's say, like, a dodge heavy that can only chain... If it's, like, a dodge heavy that can only chain into a punch on hit or block, like his forward dodge heavy, um, maybe it uses the same animations as his finisher heavies, or uses, like, a new animation, like... Um, the Veni Vidivici execution, like, you know, the, the Troy execution where he jumps forward and stabs him in the neck. What would that, that guy do? That would look pretty cool, I'd think. Um, 
Uh, I don't know if it'd be enough to bring Scent back into the meta, but it would certainly help. Would. Do you think it would? If it pinned. Uh, well, I mean, it if it pinned, pinned, yeah, but I'm not saying... <laughs> uh, do you think, Tetsuo, do you think he'd be back in the meta just with a regular dodge heavy? No. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> yeah, so get boxes on any of his moves. Yeah, that's the main thing. Oh, yeah, he's... I, so, oh, yeah, how they wouldn't be able to even... It wouldn't make sense to increase his hitbox. I mean, how how could you? Do that? It's yeah, so like it's such a weird. They're just stabs, right? <laughs> the only hitboxes he has are on his lights in the zone. And his lights are off target, um, non-enhanced, so you yeah, end up bouncing oh, yeah. off walls and stuff. So, um, yeah. his zone has got a good hitbox, actually, a really nice hitbox. But Big I mean, he would he'd be improved, but he would, you know, still be, um, yeah, you know, still, I'm not sure he has what it takes to survive in the meta of extremely big hitboxes. Because, of course, you know, you're... Uh, you know, you, you're, you're trading off one thing for another thing. We'll see. It'd be interesting to see if he did have a... If he did have a dodge attack, he might be in the meta. Because, you know, Glad is in the meta, and he's a better team fighter in general, but... You know, he's... I'm, I'm actually surprised to not see Hito. Nah, Hito's not really played at the moment. Really? People experiment no. with Hito as a... As, um... As a gank, oh man, I just got back onto him immediately gets dodged, demon balled. <laughs> nice with the missing. Uh, with that, that's the heavy is Rod taking a lot. Of, uh, no, Rod's actually doing all right. Sorry, my, my bad. Health totals looking kind of even. Oh, I said just I said that. Helvin Baron goes down, and Helvin Clory is very low and out of stamina. Um, Moki's again one bar. He's, he's going to go off and try and heal. Now this would be a good opportunity for Rod. Oh, there we go. <laughs> I was just gonna say for Rod to go and chase, um, uh, which he does manage to. Oh, that oh, break whiff was a bit weird looking, but oh damn, <laughs> Rod get pulling off double kill, and now he's gonna run to A presumably. Let's see what where he decides. To... Oh, come back, Rod. Where have you it's gone? It's not a good push at the moment. Everyone's yeah, I think. With, I mean, it would have been alright if. If those guys hadn't been killed, but seeing as he killed them both, then he's coming back. Oh, to contest a back cap from Baron, who loves doing this, by the way. Baron just loves running in here. Um, he does this pretty much every game. Miss time, Garbrig gets heavily damage reduced there. And a lot of revenge feed. I don't think they can really pull off a Zerk gank here, so they're just going to... I think they're just going to let... In 1v1. Garbrig got select select comes out... JJ, I would want. I I am interested to see what JJ, how JJ would um, oh, change in the meta if that was. You know, this is looking like an anti gank from Baron, to be honest. Um, once option selects are removed, because he doesn't have a low vulnerability. Oh, unfortunate feels bad, man. Feels bad, man. No, he did well to store for that long, though. Look at the overall points and the Helvings crew of one on mid. That one player keeping him the rest occupied. For you know, a good minute and a half has given them a massive advantage on the rest of the map. Um, and we're looking at Renown, Just Ice and Rod have got a big defender renown from that, but especially because the kill went to Just Ice, who's the heavy and gets more defender renown. If if Rod had got the kill, the defender renown would be minimal because of Assassin Assassin Renown being fun. Um, nice peel there, big hitbox coming out. And Baron pushing another back cap, but this time in a 1v1 against oh, Rod. God. So they get, it looks like these guys are losing the mid fight here. Marichal goes down, Just Ice goes down, Rod is losing his 1v1 as well, and he's going to get rotated on. Uh, that was a bad trade as well, you don't want that. I mean, this is looking really rough for Rod. <laughs> he has the light attack, is the only thing he can do then. Um, nice scar break, but not enough before he gets rotated on. And Living comes in, but is must be on low health from before. Um, can just ice anti gank here. Marichal comes in to get, oh, just absolutely eats so much damage. And now his revenge tag to run out, bleeds out. It's not what we want to see. Nicely done there with uh, a deflect. Or out to avoid the glad gank there. It's about one of the only things you can do. Um, 
And then they run off the point. Very sensible here. They, so they know they're going to they would end up losing this uh, 3v2. So they run off to avoid giving defender an arm. Well played by these Helvigan guys. Go back to mid. They've got an advantage on mid. Helvigan Baron's got free, you know, pass to go and heal. Um, Renown looking equal now. Roughly enough. enough um, they've won enough mid fights. Homka goes down. Moki is going to get parried for no punish. That was weird. Uh, living just, just getting pounded by his teammate instead of doing anything. Uh, and going back to heal or to prevent a back gap from Baron? No, oh, Baron is maybe. still in mid. Chasing just Dice, who's almost dead. And is now dead. Marachal being ganked. Corey goes back to heal. I mean, this is looking at, it's turning now into a kind of classic sense, uh, Citadel Gate game where they're just not, they're like, instead of going back into, oh, land of shenanigans. <laughs> oh, you love to see him. Oh, oh, oh. oh no. It's not right. I mean, ooh, <laughs> this is not a favored 2v2 here. Oh, very yeah. nice. Doesn't get doesn't get defender renown for that though because of being on the point. Well executed. Goki gank is not gonna kill or get revenge. Now that is uh, a lot of damage. I feel like what? Many managed to escape. <laughs> well played by Hobko. Oh my goodness. I feel like well, it would have been a better play to like throw him off the ledge. Would that be correct or not? I, mean, I don't think he could have reached. Um... No, he could. Uh, Rod, but he's running to try and heal. Rod has got there already and is dawling the heal, or Rod is doing the Baron, Baron back cap. We'll call it that. Um, what's it? The the Helvigan Jean goes down. I mean, this is a dangerous push from these guys. That should be Baron that dead. Is a very bad push. But I mean, they did. Contest the heal, they need to get the points back. So, you know, if they can, probably time to leave. I don't know if they, it looks like they can, they, it looks like they are going to be committing more Marachal coming up here. I mean, I think they, they, need, they know they need to win this fight. Um, Rod is going, going to contest the back cap. Um, I'll, I'll try and stick at this. I know this is not the best angle. Baron coming in instead of going to a back cap, he's going into. Help get kills. That's one lot of defender renown fed. Uh, Just Ice is looking very low here. Nice Sifu there to avoid damage. I mean, still winnable. Homka um, uh, comes in to finish him off. Yes. Why is it, why is the gladiator not using his tier three? Uh, he's setting it for next match. Next match, I think. I don't know. Maybe he likes using it as a. Uh, I mean. Maybe he likes using it to... <laughs> I mean, if possible, they are stalling it out until breaking now, but no, no. Okay. I think it's time to check Renown. Yeah, yeah. Renown is massively an advantage for these guys now. Like, it's, you know, they just... Huge Renown advantage from the Hel for the Helden squad. So that push has probably cost Inconsistence the game. Um, Wait, didn't even really need to win it. Yeah, I don't, don't want to don't say it. Don't wanna, Say anything too soon because the points totals are still quite close. But everybody on Helvigan, apart from Moki, has got and Homka have got tier okay two tier fours on those guys and no tier fours on the Inconsistors. Baron again saving his <laughs> his uh yeah, that that was a well timed guard break from Rod there, but uh, Marichal didn't you know trust him enough to throw through with it. Mm -hmm. Are they going for another push now? Actually, this could. Mm, they're going to get rotated on before he gets. Not going to cap it. Not going to cap it before he gets rotated. Um, maybe. Oh, or... he does get it. All right. Let's see how this goes. Oh, the defenders are breaking. They've got a big health advantage though. Um, really good use of um, phalanx coming out here. They need to come in here and support Marichal before. They're trying to push him off the point. <laughs> uh, I mean, sensible. They're still not out of the woods here. Rod low on health. Marichal again very low. Rod goes down. Marichal, like, 
This is this is this is difficult because they need. Light there, and he would have been dead. I don't know why they didn't look cool. Yeah, I mean, I don't think he needs to be fast enough. He's not. Yeah, could have could have had a light parry. Like they. Oh, I think Living is going to die into breaking if he's not careful. He's got his tier four. He needs to make sure he doesn't lose the opportunity to do that by getting glad ganked. Double breaking scenario. Let's follow these living. See if you can make it out of here alive. Rolls the longbow. Nicely used. Nice nice roll there. Um, decides himself not to longbow. Tier 4 comes out. So that's going to walk at Wolf Hunt. Okay. Oh man, this is really go either way. Oh, Good fun. use of Phalanx. Aaron's trident misses. Again, living, saving the longbow just for the next game. There it comes out. <laughs> this is, could go down to the wire. Oh, Chlorion. Minimal health. Goes back to heal instead. Oh. I mean, okay, we, this is a very, like, this is a winnable 3v2 here. Um, and the health guns can get, can get revives. Uh, I don't think they can. I mean, if they, if they manage, if they win this, if they win this two v two, okay, Living comes out with enough health to. That was well. That okay. That was well done. In that case going back to heal. Rod comes in with a heavy. Yeah, That's one goes down. It's going to be game two to the inconsistent in that case. But looks things. Okay, Ooh. unless unless Homka can can anti gank. Uh -oh. That zone object like, gets bounced off the wall. Walls are the real enemy here, right? <laughs> oh, well played by Inconsistence to keep that together at the end. That was, that was tense. I mean, I think that push at the end by Marichal ended up being think, yeah. super important because they Quite managed... Because nice, you know, he was like just a few milliseconds off of getting contested. Oh, yeah, yeah. It was super risky, but I mean, it worked out. Um, well played. This, we, have a map, we have a map three. Exciting stuff already this early in the tournament. Uh, uh, what map was it? Uh, that was Cizel Gate. The, no, map no, the, map. the next one, I, well, I'm just mm -hmm. going to check that. It is going to be Temple Garden. Wow. So, look. Wait, Temple Garden. At the bracket so far. So Nam Gloria is still, still apparently waiting on the... There. Um, no, I'm just checking. It's, sorry. Not... not um, there we go. Okay. Nam Gloria have gone through to the winner's final already. Um, they beat Emotional Boys Corner. Hellions have got one nil on Al Mugvars. So it's one all for inconsistent electrical gatchers. Let's see where the eye comes up. Any comments from anybody else? Norgos, did you enjoy that map? Yeah, I thought it was pretty pretty interesting. I very much love a double breaking scenario. And I wanted to point out that entire time they were fighting in mid, C point was open. Hmm. Early, maybe not the entire time, but for a while there they was open. When the Shigoki went to uh Went over at sea. I looked up and I'm like, yeah, there's a plus one there. So, uh, that was what was. Yeah, I, mean, I don't think they had anybody who could go and can yeah. take it. And it it it'd been a little it'd been a little risky, but. Yeah, I mean, I mean you'd think Baron would love to do that because he does <laughs> seem to love to go to the enemy home point. Um, uh, I mean that was that was a, I mean there were bad pushes on both sides. Um, but some good a bad push and a really good push from Inconsistus. So, I guess it balanced out. Exciting stuff. I know yeah, this is but... something that sounds like really minute or trivial, but in the very opening fight, and I, I think I saw this right, that when the Warlord killed the Shigoki, it looked like he changed targets to somebody that was further away. They were one shot, both of them were, so if they would have got a light parry, the Warlord would have gone down. I thought that was pretty interesting. Yeah, good idea in that case, yeah. It's always best to make sure to you, people's target swap on blockables, you can target swap anything, really. Yeah. Um, If you're a character that can do that. He was playing like Tiandi or something. <laughs> that that light would whiff and nothing would happen. Um, another reason why Kyoshin will not be seen played because he cannot hit characters that he's not locked onto. The main thing that Kyoshin has going for him is his really good tracking on his his finisher heavies, and that's uh, that's about it. Yeah, yeah, really they're, good? they're good. I mean, they're, they're undodgeable. Here. They're high damage. They I actually mean, have some quite undodgeable. Sometimes it floods across the point to another guy. Yeah, yep. yeah. It's one of these If they're in range, it will zoom to catch the person who's in range, and if they're not, they're not. Hello, hi there, Gary. How's it going? Oh, nice, nice. Which match are you watching? We are watching the 
winners semi-finals between oh, Inkle nice. Sisters and Barrett and the Helden crew. And they are 1-1 one, one at the moment on this Temple Temple match. Oh, so. beautiful, beautiful. I'm just happy that you're not watching us. <laughs> how, how did you go against your match against the Almogavars? Dude, dude, we messed it up against Helvigan so bad. But we were just Oh, we did watch that those... one, actually, so... Um... <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> you were saying? <laughs> yeah, yeah, we're just chilling in losers bracket. Having have fun. you have you won your match in oh, losers well, bracket? You'll get it next time. Yes, no, we're we against we're against emotional boys corner. Well, we'll see how that goes. Beautiful name. It's a great name, isn't it? No, the fuck I hope you it. put I hope you put them in an emotional corner. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> well, good 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 luck. Uh, all right, we're gonna have to see this in the beginning. See ya. No one puts uh, baby in the corner. <laughs> no one puts fridge clouds in the corner. <laughs> Apart from, uh, you know, the Helvigan crew who, who definitely did that earlier. <laughs> that, was a bit, that was a bit mean of me, but they, they, they did do what was quite a comprehensive picture. They need to practice on their, practice their ganks, make sure they don't mess those up. All right, so we saw a Rod Baron 1v1 last time. Let's watch the mid-fight this time. And if we, and if it, I'll, I'll keep an eye on the health totals at the top and see if it's looking to get exciting over on A. We'll, we'll just go and have a look to see that, how that 1v1 goes. Because then we went on games that are this close, like the last one ended up being, an early, you know, early point advantage can really make the difference. Big damage landing on Homka now. He's um, misses his UB there. Good dodge from Just Ice. Who seems to be again another like oh Marichal getting very low. Oh, excellent target auto blockable from Living gets gets the kill on. Moki, but they've traded one for one here. A little bit of a nice bait there. Good peel from Just Ice gets. Oh, did he kill? Wow. Living goes down and Just Ice is in a 1v2 now. He's about to get rotated on from Moki. And. Oh, Marichal's here as well. That 1v1 we're talking about is getting pretty close again. We're going to switch over to this <laughs> just because well, I want to see. Between them. It's always between. Well, yeah, these are the these are the non team fighters, right? So um, oh, just oh, yeah, goes down in that mid fight. Nice these heavy parry from. from... Oh, and one. Baron takes Ooh. it again. 2 0 to Baron in the 1v1. In the 1v1 world. And actually, it's looking. I mean, well, my living is. Favorite. This is winnable, especially with an revenge. Um, gets one kill, gets parried. Mm. Is he gonna get the second one? Dangerous. Oh! oh gets the that. second one! Oh, and, and it, cool. so he run. stalled just long enough to get his other teammates in. Oh, that was really well played by oh. Living there. And <laughs> gets, I mean, he actually gets a triple kill. Um, really? Oh, I think Robert kind of saved him. Yeah, yeah. He, so he ate the damage, but was able to then get the guard break. I mean, it's the the, the double edged sword of the uh, super. Uh, Helgen Baron gets finally takes living down, and, and this point's still good. not being taken. Um, this point just seems like a point of attrition, to be honest. <laughs> like, I mean, it's the most important they just in the coming and coming. Yeah, yeah they do, and and they, and there we here we're seeing the the importance of that initial one v one for with Baron against Rod because. They like Helgen and crew have had this passive point build up this entire time, and even though they Bruh. still haven't taken C and Living comes in again to contest, Bruh. so still not going to go either way. But like this whole time, they're building up points um, and have now 150 point hard point lead. Baron goes up there, presumably to vent a preemptive backup. Can Just Ice going down? Living trying to get the revive. He's just pressuring living with it. Um, <laughs> again, in a very winnable 1v2 here from living. And Clory goes off Bloody into the drink. Fun. And <laughs> there we go. It's finally, it got in captured. <laughs> finally, point C comes almost four minutes into the game. We finally see C taken. But with a big point advantage to the Helgen crew and... You know, uh, not a uh, re renowned advantage to just Inconsistus, which definitely will come into advantage, especially on Living. If Living can get... I mean, he's, he's close to having his Tier 4 already, 
So if he gets a, his tier 4 out, he's going to get two uses of it. Rod just eating every single attack there. That was really, get absolutely blended. And Moki goes off to heal. Incon Inconsist is losing a lot of numbers in this initial in this mid fight here. And Living must be very close to his tier 4 by now. Baron gets the kill on. And we're going to see a glad gank here. Living hasn't got Juggernaut online. Baron comes to take the uncontested C. And now we have a triple cap scenario. So this is going to be. I mean, Rod, come. Can he win this 1v1? He's got <laughs> health advantage, feet disadvantage. Does win it. Doesn't get. And gets a. I mean, this is, a, I think, probably a good push here. They've got enough. Missed time guard break then. That's, that's a, I've seen that a lot of times. Um, himself out of stamina, but external side dodges let him get away. And somebody on Inconsist is going to pick A. Living is going to pick up A and probably going to have his tier 4 very soon. Baron also going to have tier 4 soon. And up there, fight Living. We'll see what this 1v1 goes there. More Defender Renown coming out for Helvgun's crew. Let's go and see how this 1v1 is going on. Two tier 4s have come out. And they've both got the tier 4s now. I mean, definitely the Goki's one is more impactful. Pops That's Juggernaut. Great. And is <laughs> just... Oh, Helvgun Baron tries to get away. <laughs> ah! It just absolutely gets murked. There we go. And finally goes down. I mean, li Living did use two of his feats then and whilst that longbow was pretty fun like i feel like it wasn't a good use of it because he just he's about to get rotation on him they would have had a quick gank anyway look like these guys are now waiting to go fight mid i think that was probably a bad use for his tier three but see how that has any implication later on in the match big point disadvantage point deficit they have to make up now like it's getting close to being breaking for um for inconsistence yeah. Living already getting used to have his tier 4. Um, I do love watching Zerk get chased here. And is Rod going to push? No, he hasn't got there. Uh, Living's going to go down and not loot. Not... If he goes down now, that is... Uh... Yep, there we go. Big... <laughs> Still had another 15 seconds left in his tier 4, probably. So that's a lot of value lost. Clory got his has his tier 4 as well. I think we're going to see... Is that going to be... Oh. The glad lets uh, living get away. That would have been a uh, trident opportunity there. The rod has got blood. Oh man! Havgum Baron gets the kill on Rod. Good, good stuff. And this t and this mid fight, whilst you know, there were a lot of deaths on both sides, like it's they didn't really lose. Oh, they oh, okay. They just now lost mid, but they prevent. That was a really important fight because there's. Points totals are still remaining, you know, in Helvgen's favor. Homka getting a kill on A. Nice punish for that. <laughs> Another one. Very nicely done. This is going to and to Living is going to... I mean, uh, Living not going to... He gets the kill. I mean, uh, you'd think that they'd let um, Homka get the kill there because he was so close to his tier 3. You'd think. Glad gank here. That is a rod going down. Jeez, that was over very fast. <laughs> Funny flask. Funny flask happens. And that is it. That is... That was that. There we go. Helvgun crew take it. 2-1. So Not up. nearly as close as last time. And they, they really you know, stomped as soon as it got to the breaking. It's a very, very fast breaking situation. I mean, look at the kills. <laughs> Helvgun ban... And Chloe playing really, really well. Living did a really good job, especially anti-ganking on point. Marichal had, oh had a my. difficult match. Not what we want to see. Bag saying, I hope you put them in the emotional corner. Well, uh, come on. Uh, like, it's not just this. I, I don't know those guys. I know I know Fridge. Uh, He's coaching in the, the dojo, so obviously we've got to look after our own. <laughs> um... Stag calling me out for favoritism 
<laughs> Has actually anyone used Kyoshi in the, comp the tournament? No, no, it's correct. Kyoshin is, um, is banned in this tournament. You're not allowed to play a character which came out this in the same stage as the... Um, the I'm aware of this. When, when will he actually be unbanned? Next stage, so stage two. Uh, stage three even, so that'll be sometime in the beginning of um, next season, probably. But I don't think we'll see him. We'll see him played as for the reasons I've mentioned before. Um, bad hitboxes, bad feats. Understandable. Bad uh, against. They, uh, I mean, from what I've heard, the only redeemable feat that Kyushin has is tier four. Uh, where Tetsuo was talking about earlier, his tier four is all right, but it's not. Yeah, you know, it's incredible not... or anything. It's nothing like. I don't think it's nothing as good as as the tier fours of the characters that are in. Um. That are in currently in the meta. So, so what you're saying is make it the same speed as Pugio. <laughs> <laughs> same speed as Pugio would be <laughs> nutty. I really think it's more likely, more case that the uh, other feats are really a bit too. Uh -huh, 300 ms Pugio go brr. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Very, that was a good brr. I love your roll, rolled R's there. Wonderful. All right. So we have, it's going to be um, the Nova Crew. Not mean to be though. Um, against so Obu Yogurt Ficus against Helvigan Baron, and I will see what maps they are picking and banning. Okay. So when they remove option selects, who do you think would jump up in the ranking? Um, one second. Let me just, so um, so we have at the moment we have Garden, Overwatch, and something in Russian. Um, <laughs> Beachhead, okay. It's like, okay. Thank you for Nova York has, has clarified the image Beachhead instead of whatever that is. Can't read Cyrillic myself. Um, yeah. Okay. Uh, so, who do I think will go up in the meta with the Roof of Auction selects? Um, I mean, in 1v1s, it's a lot easier to say. Um, PK is going to be scary. Uh, Raider, yeah, especially if the Raiders know. rework <laughs> comes out tap. in the. I mean, Storming Tap was no joke in. Well, I mean, he was he was obviously vulnerable to dodge attacks, but if his chain hyper armor got buffed, Storming Tap is yeah, a. Yeah, I don't know why they removed that. They I, well, they, they removed it armor. to remove car breaks on successful attacks. Oh, yeah, I thought you could do that. But I mean, I don't think that was a good enough reason to remove it, to be honest, but he will be, be a very good. One v one character, if um, with even even with just his that rework changes, but with extra changes, he will be very good. I mean, I think probably meta character. I don't know if we'll see him played in forty fours because the recoveries were still very bad. Um, but he has good feats. He got really good feats actually. Um, uh, Stag mentioned that crashing charge is due to be nerfed in next season. Yeah, actually, that have it. It the bug, on the bug fix on the bug tracker. We have a bug track. Talking about the super armor on crashing charge, and apparently that is scheduled to be removed. Nice. Um, which is, I mean, it's still going to be a very good move if you know if you can yeah. chain it off. But what's the difference between that and raiders? Well, um, yeah, I mean, <laughs> you can't you can't chain it off things. But so, but if ra raiders rework sped his up and actually will move it a lot closer to crashing charge and stampede charge, will be very similar in terms of. I mean, crashing charge. Is I don't killed. think they're even close in power. No, no, but with the crash, so crashing charge is going to have its hyper arm removal. Hi there, freeze, by the way. Um, with crashing charge, hyper arm removal, they will and and stampede charge being sped up. I think they will be a lot closer. I'm not sure they'll be, you know, equivalent. But raider will have a lot of tools that warlord won't have with option selects being removed. Um, he's got a dodge attack. He's got big on block balls, which we you know are valuable in these. Can also um, clear mid pretty much instantly with his tier three. Yeah, you got uh, battle cry is really strong tier three. Like it's crazy strong. Um, free mid, which is super important. We've seen like how many times we've we seen these double breaking scenarios where they need to run into mid and win mid. <laughs> and and that and that's a critical thing. Well, Raider gets it for free, just popping his tier three <laughs> and a damage buff. So you know that's a. I need the vanguard, so he gets quite a lot of. Um, yeah, he gets more points. defender and. Down than others, twenty five instead of twenty. I'm gonna go get myself some to eat. 
I'll be back, y'all. When's my yep. order coming? GG's. Oh shit, my order's here. Uh, I need to cut his off. Alright, later. Alright, see ya guys. See you in a bit. So, and we have... So something just Sorry, popped in my head about Raider. Mm -hmm. he, like, everything is always revolved about his chains. Like, he has uh, not... Uh, he His pressure is mainly from, the, though, from that. Like... Yeah. Like he has the tap from each chain, the hyper armor heavies from chain, unblockable also chain. It just feels like he's a, a chainy boy. Always just, uh, his kid just revolves about the chain pressure. Oh, it's not, not, yes. not necessarily a bad thing. I mean, um, I mean and it's not terrible, up. but it always feels like in my head, it feels like a one trick pony. Like, it's always revolves around his uh, chains and chains, he, he, nothing else, just... Uh... I mean... Okay, <laughs> so what? <laughs> like, JJ, J, we see JJ played and JJ's really not got, you know, he's got a neutral bash, I well, guess. Well, JJ has but, a neutral like... bash and stuff like that. I mean, uh, Raider will have enhanced stunning tap, um, storming tap even, and a soft faint from neutral, which is, you know, unreactable, and a neutral unblockable with a good hitbox and 12 stamina. Yeah, I mean, I don't think we we don't know. It depends on his recoveries, and obviously can't say if we've seen him. But I, I feel like if there's a character that is most likely to win big in the um with the removal options next, I think it's probably Raider. And if he gets extra changes, I think we'll see him in the in the 44 meta. Ficus whiffing a guard break and getting twatted for it. Yoga is going up. The We're having another Berserker Gladiator 1v1 on A, by the way. Yogurt is going up to um, can push that point, which is interesting. If that 1v1 is lost, then it's also a defender run as well for the Gladiator, although not considerable. Um, he just gets pushed out of stamina. How's the rest of this team fight going? Actually, it looks like the Helvigan guys have got a, a big health lead on... I mean, considerable health lead on uh, Nam Gloria. Because it's good. Because it goes down. Obu goes down. Hiran goes down. That is nicely done. Wow. And they get team wipes at Ace Renown. They lost the 1v1 on A as well. This is a really good start for the Helvigan crew. Oh, I just Extra. noticed that they kept the other points as well. Yeah, yeah. So that was the A. They had a Baron is playing his gong over there. Or was at least. And we're going to have another 1v1 now with the Yogurt going into Gladiator. If he's going to push it again, I'm not sure that's necessarily the best choice to send one here and not send somebody else to gank two. And instead of that, let's, like let's go and look game. over. Gaining points the just team. for camping. Oh, yeah, that's uh, how boosting works. This team fight's going in. Oh, Kieran put himself out of stamina. I was going to say the team fight was going all right for um, Nam Gloria, but then Hiran does that and goes out of stamina and eats a huge amount of damage for it. And also, did you notice how Obu didn't have any peel available when he was when uh, Hiran went himself out, put out of stamina, and then gets all the point not for the defender now because he knows that this is it. Another ace. This is looking incredibly dominant for the Helden crew. I mean, look at the, look at Renown. They're gonna have tier threes on everybody almost. I mean, okay, tier threes coming out in a bit for Baron and Moki, but the other guys haven't even got their tier ones yet. This is clearly a stump. This is very, I mean, I, I, I would say nearly impossible to come back from at this stage. What a, what a coup! And I mean, Nam Gloria have great many more points than them. Um, they beat them last time as well, fairly comfortably in the previous qualifier. And now, and now they've got, they got to win these team fights now with a massive feat advantage. Like, this is going to be very hard. Another damage buff comes out. Juggernaut. Uh, Moki. Going to make him very hard to kill now. And get separated, so Hiran is not able to put. Oh, well, Juggernaut is finished off, but Ooh, at this rate, Obu might get his tier one. There we go, tier one out on Obu. Um, somebody else has died on a. 
Oh no! <laughs> I was looking at the health totals. Uh, the gladiator was bleeding out on A. Almost capped it, but died before he did. That is... I, I, it's like, I don't know if I'd want to go over there to see it, but... Unfortunate. And losing this team fight as well. I mean, like the feet, the feet advance without the feats, they would have, they would have won, I think. But it's such a massive feet disadvantage there. Oh, this is looking really very, very bad for the Nova, Nova Crew Nam Gloria. So we have the, these are the two different Russian uh, uh, clans, by the way. Nam Gloria, Nam Gloria belongs to the Nova clan, and the Helvgen Crew, well, clearly belongs to the Helvgen clan. And um, nice. Dodge out of there. I think we just saw a longbow come out on Yogurt. I mean, this is... Oh, jeez. This is really Nine bad for Nam Gloria. Oh, and they've got... Beautiful. I mean, what are they going to do here? Gladiator gank. Are they going to finish him off with the, the Trident, or is he saving it for next match? Well, Toastab does it. And that's it. Jesus Christ. Did we see... One takedown. That is one of the most one-sided games I have ever seen in a winner's final. Wow. Yeah, rip. Rip. I mean, I mean, look at that. Uh, Holy not God. just any rip, a major rip. Oh, yeah. yeah. That's, that is... Yeah, that's you as you were. That is point. painful. And this was a Nova Cruz map pick as well. So, I mean, they're going to have to... They're going to have to sit back and, like, what, less than five minutes for that match. 90 points to 1,000, 1,090 points. That is the it definition lasted, lasted of a stomp. Five minutes, just five minutes. That is, it lasted. take a screenshot yeah. of that. That's just, that's, the, that's that just one hell of a, that's one hell of a, <laughs> finish the screen up. See, if they see if they can pull it back. This is going to be really hard, for them, not just because they're already at a one map disadvantage, but psychologically, yeah, Coming back from a stomp like that is not easy. That's, that's what I was uh, thinking of. Like mentally, it should like yeah. it's, it's painful. Mentally painful. Yeah, this is the match is already up. Have Overwatch second one will go. We'll go go from the beginning again. See if they can recover from that. You know, I will never financially recover from. Uh, this. Yeah, yeah, they will never find it renownedly colored from. I don't know what I'm talking about. Yeah. Yep, renownedly. Yeah. Recover. Doesn't work at all, is it? <laughs> I'll never feet financially recover from it. There we go. All right, we'll see if they can pull it back. This JJ was not uh <laughs> was not with them today. Look, look at this yellow material on over Oru. Absolutely horrifying. Oh, Imagine yeah. running that into that on a dark night, and just or even a bright daylight. Just, 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 a, just do not like. And I don't like the hit that he's. And there are some yellow sword, yellow blades. So I just pick one of those. Why have a blue blade that clashes with your yellow color? I, mean, I can, under, I can understand the blue and yellow, but it's not well done. Banana JJ no, knew what have you done? I mean, the, the thing we is. The thing is, the Mary Gold is like so flashy. It's, you you feel like you're just watching like a a paint that has been put on the <laughs> the armor, which is why well, I they have a pretty... really bad starting rotation. These guys are sleeping off spawn. Oh, um, oh. I mean, it's not the worst, but nice external dodge there to avoid the undodgeable. As you as you notice, uh, Ficus was able to dodge the undodgeable zone, and that is because. Uh, Undodgeables are only undodgeable for the person you're locked onto, and it wasn't locked onto Moki. Moki has eaten a lot of damage. This team oh. fight started to look very much in favor of um, Inconsi uh, sorry, the Nam Gloria, but they have given re revenge to... Oh, man. Revenge to Chlore, who's got a kill just from that one revenge throw. He managed to get that two, I mean, probably two heavies. Gets out of there, try and heal. I mean, this is still a win of all. Yeah, that revenge pop there was actually super big on Fikas. Um It's really, they could have cleaned up this team fight a lot faster. And as it is, Hiran gets a kill. Doesn't go for the execution, otherwise he would have died. And 
gets parried and gets killed. Well played by Nam Gloria. I mean, that was quite a comprehensive initial fight. They actually did quite well to, rather than kill the kill off the Moki and Clore, letting them go and heal wasn't necessarily the worst thing because they put them out of the fight for a long time. Um, well, this is a much better start. Definitely a much better start. So we've got a mid fight going on there. Moki is going to yeah push into mid. That's sensible. If he'd gone to back to C, one of these guys would have been able to rotate out from the mid fight and you know gank so it would not be a good push there and then here and instead comes out to cover obu returning fenting a cap getting a heal i mean helvigan looking looking good for this in, for health at the moment let's have a look up this team fight here yoga goes down we see figures go down to the gladiator there as well Obu is now getting ganked on his home point. This is a really... I mean, there we go. We're we going to see another ace? No, because we get the... The Zerk gets a respawn, but that's bad. That is bad. Heron goes down as well. They yeah. are now double capped. Pardon? As it goes again, Mother's losing. Yeah, this is looking... Who the hell just great. broke something? Right, let's um sorry, I just need to check something over here. One second. Uh I think there's a recent dispute, so let me just quickly check that. Sorry about this. It is fine. Take your time. Will they really only you recover from this? Find out in the next <laughs> <laughs> I mean this is looking after a better start, this is looking Oh nice. Fix gonna anti gank here? I mean, maybe they just weren't warmed up. They the the teams they fought earlier in the in the the tournament were you know, certainly much lower quality than these Helvin guys. Um, let's see, is a. I mean, I think this is a. I was going to say a favored one v one, but then putting yourself out of stamina against Goki is not necessarily the, the wisest thing to do. And Baron tries to get out of there and is. Oh no! That was really bad. Right. What do you think will come of Black Friar's zone attack once option selects are removed? I mean, it's still useful as a mid cup tool. That yeah, it's a different dodge timing compared to the that normal revenge dodge. feed there <clears throat> was absolutely critical. Like it that was that was really bad. That cost them this point. I mean, I I don't know. Is it say cost them, it's going to cost them the game, but because they're clearly already behind a long way, but I mean, this is not already not as one sided as the previous time, but it's looking pretty one sided. Let's have a look. They got uh, they got damage reduction off of that GB from the Shugo. Yeah, they did. There was a mistimed yeah, GB. Yeah, that, that's they had what happened. It properly. Yep. Um, that would have been Gonzo's, but they did not. I mean, the Tom... headbutt would have killed. It's just headbutt would have killed as well. Yeah, but. Uh... <clears throat> Because gets a gets a kill. Yeah, so look at Clory in a one v one gets the zone parry. I mean, look again. Look, there's such a big renowned advantage here. Like, even if they do get a gank on this guy, if they if they can put if he gets any opportunity to pull to pop out phalanx, he's got another. There we go. So gets a kill on Zerk. I mean, this is looking real bad. No, the kill. I mean, at this point, the defender now hardly matters because they're already they're already so far ahead in in terms of feats. Um, Kieran is going to get double punish. That's a lot of damage coming out on Moki. Um, Fury with the defensive buff as well as the attacker buff. Pikus goes down from the unblockable. Kieran is not longer for this world either. Defender Renown. See, this, in the course of this fight, Defender Renown has given Moki his Tier 3 and his Tier 4. And they have managed to finally take a point for themselves, but, I mean, look at the Renown. They haven't... Some of them, they got their Tier 2s, some of them. But, you know, against Tier 4s, they've already had a use as well. Um, I didn't notice Honker getting a use for his Tier 4, but... 
Well, we'll see how this goes. <laughs> I mean, I think the Helvgen crew are... There with that demon ball. I think they're just oh, clowning around. Oh, that is, oh, that's a oh, that is an absolutely one. disgusting tier four there. Oh my god, they just got an annihilated. Well, they, they call that feat what they call it the AC 130, and that very much was an AC 130. Uh, that long that long was long as, long as, long. As, about as effective as it, as it were. Uh, an AC 130. That was, again, another stomp. Another and, uh, renowned Leon financial. Yeah. They, Feels uh, bad, I have to look up this. Um, yeah. I've got a dispute I need to take a look I at. I can take over, Spanning. All right. Okay. Um, in that case, you can, you've got the. You, you can start streaming to either straight to the stream key or to. Stream Discord. key? What? Uh, you'll just do it, no, do it to my no, Discord no. in that case. I um, swapped to stream. I've probably swapped to threes already. Oh, great. Okay, I am now. My yeah, yeah. game is now frozen, yeah. so I can't. I'm awaiting yeah, orders to, to, to just pick it. God, there's a lot of these. Been a load of um, disputes today. Was it a two O or is it still? That was two O, yeah, two O, and a comprehensive oh, okay, one so like that. Um, yeah, very comprehensive two O. That's why I'm looking at the wrong freaking. Can you tell me who's fighting next? Do I have these um, people? One second, let me just have a look. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This. Well, I think uh, the Hellions will be playing again. Um... I think they should have had enough time to, to get wrapped up by now, shouldn't they? Uh, yeah, there's been a dispute over there. Okay, I've oh, just got used... it. That's a... Okay. So let me check the brackets for you. Um... So the game to watch will be Hellions versus the Emotional Boys Corner, and that is um, Lucifer and Car. You know, Fridge Klaus. Um, then mm -hmm. we will carry YouTube. All right, those are half then. By the way, Sven, you're still streaming in Discord. Okay, well, I'll sort that out in a second. Let me um, stop streaming. There we go. Um. Imagine if it would crash the game if there's like 500 uh, spectators. Yeah, I mean, you that don't uh, directly fun. affect the game. It's like a recording that gets played from a server. I don't know. I think it's like a 10 seconds delay if you're doing from recent position. Uh, yeah, you I should mean, be able to set it like in game. There's a setting where you can set it, it just doesn't delay. work. Um, but it's yeah, it doesn't work, and there's probably a minimum on top of that, anyways.
Two two against two one one. Alright, Lucifer. My game is. It's a good time you did, Super, because my game has just crashed. The stream's really like a Oh, it flipped the thing. Haha. <laughs> Yes, that's the recent bug. It is now showing yeah. up one. Wait, what? Uh, Can I even... Wait, hang on. What did I want? Sorry, my bad. I forgot what I wanted to do. Alright, yeah, that confused me. Ooh, Discord stream is really bad quality. Discord stream is um, barely oh, visible. Oh, Jesus. Twitch as well. Yeah, well, the Twitch it's... is... Watching what's on Discord. Yes, so. Yeah, everyone, so, everyone watching on Discord right now, can you please join the Twitch stream instead and stop watching on Discord? Yeah, you because do the that is. Uh... Of the stream a major favor because that's currently what's Sorry, happening. sorry. That's all right, yeah. yeah. Better to watch on um, uh, Twitch rather than Discord. The link is in the chat. Yeah, I don't, I don't really use Twitch that much, so. Oof. It's okay. It's just uh, we can get more than one frame a second, whoever has got to. It's still the really special cool. internet. Dude, I'm confused. What buttons the fuck? What am I pressing? I yeah, can't I... switch to people I want to. I'm, I'm like, <laughs> one, to, to one to four is for, um, who, who, who joined? Just joined chat? Uh, let me look at the voice uh, box. Uh, is that always flipped now? Um, it looks like or it is, yeah. Randomly. It's odd because it's, it's, it's uh, currently, uh, Okay, it's Charles, so, I'm going to have to kick you from the... the um... Which chat is it? Mm. Oh, did I kick them from the server? Shit. Um, no, that shit. Watching, <laughs> the person wasn't What's even watching. Uh, guys. Well, rip after. Whoever's watching... Yeah. Don't um... watch the stream. Don't watch the Discord stream. Watch the Twitch stream instead. And just Fred, we... Um, Freeze is streaming to uh, Freeze is streaming to Discord, and I'm picking up that stream and putting it on Twitch. So we I'm just can't uh, stream on the Twitch quality is yeah, very. Yeah. Are you watching on? Yeah, that's because Twitch someone's potato? watching on Discord. Yeah, with bad the quality. I'm just gonna have to just disconnect as many people as possible. I'm sorry until this, this is more this than ten out. people. I don't think it is more than ten right now. Sorry, everybody. Uh, quality goes down, and if someone is watching yeah. with, like really bad internet, then the stream I'm adjusts just to just to... that person, which means everyone watches five pixels. By the way, Sven, that, if you that seems... if you go on the stream and you you go to the bottom left, you can see what who's actually watching. So don't kick. I can. Notice. Okay. Yeah. Um. <laughs> all right. Who? Where's 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 that? Who's? What can I see? Who's watching? Bottom bottom left. No, I can't. Oh, you mean if I go to the stream itself? Yes. To the video feed. Okay, me, Zuzume, and Tetsuo. I'm yeah, that, the next. thing is, those are the people that, are, that, that we're already watching before before oh, Freeze joined. Is it really bad? It's confusing. Again, is it yeah. bad? It's incredibly really? bad. One frame per second, per second, maybe? I'm not sure. Yeah, it became I'm... a slideshow. Yeah, I think maybe Freeze used to restart the stream as because, uh, because yeah, it's it's like en enough of us. Have been, I've just kicked everybody oh, from the chat, basically. No. Um, mm, it was fine for a second, but then I dipped it immediately. I don't know. Yeah, that's not. I have nothing running in the background. I just oh. it's a fresh reboot. Yeah, for me it's better. The game was fucking with me. Better. It's better. Um, sorry to everybody who I've uh, kicked from the voice chat, the voice channel. I mean, sorry it's just that. Um, just fine. the format here. Yeah, blame Discord. Time. Yeah, sorry about that. Um, I, it was it was it was actually Freezer's fault all along. Yeah, um, I'll You're stop taking full blame. It's all right. <laughs> hey there, Kyle. How's it going? I need to go and find whoever it is I actually only kicked from the server and then <laughs> um, pull them back. And give them an invite. Sorry about that. Um, going well. I had uh, I had a bunch of <laughs> problems yesterday. They're trying to stream and, or actually record and then Discord stream at the same time. Actually, caused my old, uh, PC to lock up. So maybe they've uh, changed a little something. Mm. Well, if that's how it's not working, uh, Stag, I suggest you just freeze can stream directly to Twitch by putting the the stream key in there. I um, don't have anything set up to stream right now. Oh, okay, not at all. Oh, fair enough. No, it's just. Uh... I mean, I can go back. I mean, to I have it. OBS running, but that OBS is just for recording, so I don't want to press the wrong button and then suddenly stream whatever yeah. I'm yeah. recording. Maybe I should go back to um, spectating it, in that case. It's still cause... bad. 
Yeah. Yeah, it's uh, yeah. I think I, mean, I think Twitch stream is pretty I bad. Honestly, I think I think this is for some reason maybe cast by you freeze because it was like okay the, the, the same people were watching Spanish yeah stream, yeah and it was incredibly fun so I don't know what's going on here all right well I, my game crashed so I will lock uh don't worry we'll give it up for now whilst I whilst I get, I'll get my game back up again right, um don't worry about it it's, it's just how it is and it's, oh is that it was freeze's fault yeah, I'm, I'm taking <laughs> blame, blame for freeze. so many things. It's um, I'm used to. It. <laughs> yeah, you, uh, you got it off killing Shinobi as well. Um, I think I'm going to change the team name to blame it on Rippy to blame it on Freeze. <laughs> Good idea. So I, I haven't watched any games today. While we're waiting on the new thing to load up, what's what's going on? Who's who's winning? Who's looking like the favorite here? What's happening? Um, so extra gachi guys. Um. Uh, they, who are the Helvgen. Okay, well, actually. There's a right. Russian C team, basically. No, Russian, uh, yeah. oh, Russian nice. B C team. Russian B team's still here, though, right? Like, Nam Gloria is. Nam Gloria is uh, currently in, in the tournament, but they are fighting for their. They're going to be fighting in the, from the losers' brackets because they were eliminated 2 0 in some of the most comprehensive stomps I've seen in a winner's final um, in the whole Dominion series. Like, the. Oh, the, they lost in winner's finals? They lost in winners finals, and they lost badly in winners finals. Like to, the first who match, the players, just like what uh, were their names? Helvigan, Moki, Helvigan, Baron, Helvigan, okay, okay, uh, Chloray, okay. and right? no, Yogurt's on Nambori. Right. Um, Moki, Chloray, Baron, and Homka. That's the one. Um, those guys. And I mean, they, they, they it, the first one was a uh, ninety points to a. It was less than five minutes long. It was a quite one-sided match indeed. Try to, wow. I'm really sorry to the poor, poor <laughs> guy who I accidentally kicked from the server by instead of trying to disconnect them from the from the call. Um, and I can't wow. I can't invite them back because they <laughs> uh, because uh, they haven't got their they've got their DMs blocked and they're not accepting friend requests. So, rip. Sorry there, um, mole rat. Please bad, come man. back. I'm. Sorry please for, come back. Yeah, please come back. It was an accident. Um, it, was he watching the Twitch stream? Does he know? He probably thinks I, I don't know. I don't know. Um, I'm gonna leave up the brackets until this either fixes itself or we're gonna we're gonna watch we're gonna switch back to Spanish. I'm not sure. Uh, okay, freeze kill. No, no. Hang on, I'll restart the thing. <laughs> was I being too fast? I'm just. Oh, I don't. Nice. I don't know what it is. Like everything's fine. Uh, and it's um, slowing down again. And I honestly don't know. Yeah, it's confusing. I have nothing else wrong him. Well, I will. Gr don't worry about it. Just, just, just how it is. Um, people, who's on those? People in Twitch teams? Are blaming you now. <laughs> yeah, it's still like one frame a second. Um, who's who's currently playing? Is it? Oh, I think the match is finished anyway. Not yet, not yet. Or maybe. Are we, what are we waiting on? Are we waiting on losers bracket to finish up? For grands? Is that what we're waiting on? Uh, yeah, we are. Yeah. Sorry, I need to take this. Um. Basically, semi semi losers. Can they just uh, freeze directly from the game? Who's someone's got some really horrible. Um, feedback coming on, so um, yeah, Mr. Potato, potato. Mm. yeah, uh, and no, our setup's a bit complicated. We do, we have it easier if it worries you. Uh, and now there's no stream, yeah. Um, uh, I'll sort out in a sec. We haven't got a match to watch anyway at the moment because they've all finished. Um, so just give me a second. Um, just hop over to the bracket screen. Uh, yeah. Sorry, if I, uh, sorry, everyone. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if they've uh, changed something around about how something's working with spec mode and stuff. But for a long time, I've been like running spec mode, recording it, doing other stuff, and I was just trying to record and uh, Discord stream yesterday, and it was just I was getting uh, like FPS drops in the spec mode, and then my whole computer froze and. I don't know, it was 100% oh, yeah. like CPU usage, which was just a little abnormal for me. I don't have like the most powerful PC, but I've never had trouble doing that. Like I've done that before and it wasn't an issue. 
No, it's terrible. No, Discord, one hundred percent. It's it's absolutely, unfortunately, Discord. I'll, I'll let me go to use your you know product and everything, but your streaming stuff is just absolutely terrible right now. It uses way more resources than it should need, and it just bogs down everything else. You you mm. you could probably open up three different OBSs and stream and still be fine. Open and then you then you open up one OBS and one Discord at the same time. Yeah, you're done. That's crazy. I didn't. I, yeah, it, it recently has has changed like that. It's not. Um, it wasn't. Yeah. It wasn't always like that. Yeah, it's been like that. Uh, I think may have maybe for I don't know a few weeks now at least that I've noticed. Yeah, but no, it's not just... been. It's not been a permanent thing. No, that's new. I don't know what they did. All right. Um. Like we're just, well, still. We don't worry. We're waiting for matches anyway. So. Uh. Yeah, the... I just have the bracket screen open. Up until okay, so we're waiting for Inconsistors. Um... Guys, uh, you excited for the NA tourney today? Absolutely. Bro. I'm, I'm I'm more excited to maybe potentially get a nap, though. I am waiting on the uh, internet guy to come here. Oh, uh, okay, okay. Is, is he going to be there before the tourney call. starts? Huh? Is he going to be there before the tourney starts? Yeah, he should be here any minute now, actually. Uh, so hopefully... Uh... Hopefully he can find something they can fix, but I'm thinking they're going to have to send the overnight people over, so we'll see. Maybe just bring a new uh, new uh, hardware? I don't uh, think that's the issue. It's 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 not a... I've, I've used their hardware before. It's going to be uh, it's going to be a big turn today. We got uh, Clowns V2. The... Oh, shit, the Clowns V2 I'm playing. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. It's a thrill new Mamba, Will and Vane. And then... Uh... It's gonna be it's gonna be a good day. Lots of lots of fun games to watch. Yeah, there's there's a couple there's a couple there's a couple new new teams with some old faces. Saw that. I saw that. I'm telling you, I can't sleep on NA. We surprise. We aim to please. We've had some really entertaining uh, tournaments. I guess, Just... how are y'all doing today? How are you doing? Eh... Yeah. I agree. No word, yeah. <laughs> let's see. Okay, um, alright. I still, still haven't got the uh, eyes up. I can try going... I'll try sharing my screen again so you can see if it's at least laggy... Uh, we can watch my mouse moving around. It's going to be horrible lag or not. Um, I don't see sorry to everybody I kicked from the kicked from the voice chat. Um, who anybody who would want to be? <laughs> um, the stream is fine. Yeah, you're good. I'm going to ping a uh, ping Tetsuo to to come back. <laughs> Lol, and hashtag so blame freeze 2021. Is <laughs> my uh, is my stream at least looking my my version still looking okay? Yeah, you look fine. All right, great. Am I allowed to watch the stream? Because last time I yeah, did. I mean you can try you can try, <laughs> but it's better to watch on Twitch in general. Yeah, I'm you're... sorry, but yeah, I'm just watching on Twitch last time. Yeah, that's that's better. I'm just, I'm just kind of hesitant to watch the stream this time because like I was just boo out like I don't know what's happening. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really sorry. Yeah, and, you know, just, it's, it's just the way we're doing these. I my PC isn't good enough to stream to Twitch. It just it basically ah. puts out worse stream quality than that or with nothing else. It's just my CPU is not good enough. Um, Feels bad, man. And we, because we, the way we do this, with the way we do the, the, the dojo, we often have different people coming in and hosting, um, and that kind of stuff. We have been doing it, streaming it via Discord, so that we could be much more flexible with who, um, who is currently providing the, providing the footage. And then Stag has been streaming to Twitch, and and saving them to to YouTube. And actually, mostly because they were originally as an archive for the dojo, which was only really originally just for. Um, just for the just for the, the Discord call, so it didn't really matter. But now it does. Uh, that's how it be. All right. Okay. Okay. Still waiting on the eyes. The map we are going to be seeing will be. Um... All right. 
as being some okay. Oh, uh, there's an eye. Okay. Well, let me see. Let uh, let me know if this is working or not. Um, Seems to be. For now, at least. So we have inconsistus versus the emotional boys' corner. Um, and all of them have lollies as their tag. <laughs> oh, I like their little, um, I like their their um, emblems. Those are fun. Oh, uh, little... well, just pure blackness. No, 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 no. The lollies guys have got like a. Oh. It looks like um. Well, they're all the samurai faction. That's good to know. Uh, they've got little masks and eyes going on, like ninja in ninja eyes. Although we could say they got one of brows as well. So maybe maybe it's not the best. They're running a Nabushi, which is nice to see in this tournament. So, and they beat um, Hellions just earlier. So we shall see. There's a lot of team fight on that comp, and uh, it is indeed not a lot of gank. Team. No gank at all. But um, well, they got Goki. Have they got Goki? They do. Yes, they, do. they got Goki. So I mean, Goki is the main ganker at the moment, right? Um. Would you say that like to have a bash, like a real bash, like a good bash? Yeah, good. yeah. But then neither do uh, just the inconsistency either. They have got you know, their their ganker is Zerka as, as well, I guess. That's right. Yeah. Wow. Indeed. Did they pick it up too? The the Zerka. The no, yeah. no way, no, no way over here is rocking the Zerk. Oh, uh, look, um, Rod's rocking the Zerk. Oh, did, sorry, did you did, did, did no, NA? NA. NA. Oh, okay, yeah. yeah, no, no, no. So... We don't have any, like, resident, like, One's going A. love to play Zerk anyway. That's quite unconventional. Yeah, they went 3-1. It's a good strat on this map. Yeah, I mean, that's the that good thing to go, and it and looks like they are, you know, kicking the ass of these guys in their team fight at least. Marichal's got a place to go heal. Living got an execution. A let's have a look at the Nabushi. I'm not seeing, I like to see I like to see Nabushi's played, so that's a guaranteed headbutt if you don't parry that thing. It's Rod coming in. Boy. I mean lot this fairly Oh wow, big hit with the <laughs> uh, well I I, I, say, I say big and then Oh well, we that threw was threw him and damage reduced it. Yeah, actually that was I mean he he didn't No no what happened was actually it was the, the Lollies guy got the guard break, right? And rather than throwing an attack, which would have damage reduced it, he just let the guard break be, you know, counter itself. Well, I, and thought then that gave him him forward. I thought he forward threw him. I no, I don't think so. Um, this guy shouldn't be here, by the way. They should 2-2 two -two this. There's no need to have mid. You have both side points. Put two on each point and make them come fight you there. Like, you can clear minions, but as soon as you see any person whatsoever coming into the mid lane, you absolutely leave. Because now, look, he's fighting down here for nothing. If he wins this fight, he won't get anything fancy out of it. If he was five feet higher and up on the stairs, that would this fight would be hugely in his favor. Yeah, because and... all the people who die are giving him renown in the other fights. But instead, I mean, I he's fighting to trying to push the stairs. Yeah. He might be he's trying, to, trying to get on the point, but... There we go. He now, he's now on the point, but it is quite late. And he wouldn't have lost half his health trying to get on the point had he not been at mid trying to kill eight minions. Uh, at the end of the day, though, it hasn't worked out too badly for these guys. I mean, they're probably fairly confident in their abilities versus this uh, enemy team. But yeah, it is, uh, you know, in general, not, doesn't mean that you should play badly. Um, hey, you can just out-muscle a lot of people when you're better than them. I mean, it yeah, doesn't matter, but... That's what they did. <laughs> you uh, you make it you make it less difficult on yourself if you'll do that. Like those dudes down there clearing mid, they can come clear all day, all four of them. They can kill every minion they want for the rest of the game. It will yeah, not matter. They, they just, still will not uh, out. No. Sports, this is a tiny sports. map. You just match numbers. They stand right there like they're doing. He sees three. Now he goes in perfect, and then he will, Rod watches the other guy. Now Rod takes a one v one up here. Let him get Let's on the watch point. The... So you can do that. And Let's watch one v one. I think he would have got a guaranteed light off that because I was now a lot punish. But Rod absolutely blendering. Oh. oh, oh, oh. Let's see. Uh, we... And yeah, we love to see the deflects. Everybody loves them. And there we go. And he Rod actually him perfected him as well. So that was a 
Nice. I mean, only five renown for assassin, so it's not like it's you know world ending, is it? But, um, Whatever. It's five more than you had. Five more than four. But big renown advantage to these guys, like massive renown advantage even. Use all your feats in this fight right now and absolutely end the game. Yeah, I mean, they, they've got uh, Marichal should longbow lollies. Um, Not to interrupt, but like the Twitch stream is like 10 seconds behind or something. <laughs> oh, I mean, that's how it goes. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah it's going to be a and It's also over. variable per person as well, so... Um, true, true. You know, you could reload it, and it might it might come out a bit um bit sooner on. Hopefully, if you're, I guess, if you're listening to the call, then you're ah oh, friendly fire with the arrow strike. Love to see it. I've actually Ooh. been having so much fun with arrow strike recently. It just, I, I, it's amazing. I love that feat. Good feat. Nice tier four coming out there. I mean, this should be. This should go. Um... If he's gonna die here, then next fight this tier four should come out. There's no need to hold this yeah. thing to the end. I get yeah, if he, he doesn't want to. Whoa! Ooh. All oh, right, that guy's nice dead. dead. Yeah. Oh no, you got yeah. L L Lolly's interrupted him. Oh, but then he walked into the fire, so he died anyway. Rip. You can go to A. Yep. Yeah. Living yeah. death. Go to A. Marshall. Going, not going down, and just I managed to get on the point just in time. A is being contested by. Well, presumably the high health JJ over there. Um, Just Ice in a very winnable 1v2. No, Just Ice is here. He's the high health JJ. No, I meant the enemy JJ no, on JJ. Finding A. Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't know the names. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, Cheese Zeron. He's the Goki, isn't he? No. No, no he's not. No, dude, I don't know. I'm just guessing. <laughs> uh, Living doing a really good job. I don't think Living's taking any freaking damage from it, from this in this 1v1. No. I mean, um, this, this matchup is... Tough. Oh, that was not an ideal game. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. I mean, we've seen these guys mess up their Zerk, ga Zerk Goki ganks uh, more than a couple of times. I mean, that's dead though. So there we go. When this when this match started, you were telling me those are both the gankers. So they had two gankers and still. Yeah. <laughs> Lolly's eating a lot of damage from his teammate. Yeah, he um, he zoned him really well though. Yeah. All right, time time for oh. oh. Time for destruction. Destruction package delivered. Yeah. Oh, Absolute up. annihilation there. <laughs> oh, what are we watching here? We are watching uh, the losers uh, semi-finals. Semi Inconsistus yeah. versus the emotional boys corner. Um and living getting three light parries in a row on this uh on Mahu. Last week Dom series? Uh, yes, this is the last week of Dom series. We, we are qualifier for number four for EU. The winners of this one take the last space in the majors. And it, looking at the moment, I mean, uh, the winners have gone to winners final are um, the Helvgen crew. So, which I guess we, we people call it the Russian C squad, but uh, yeah. they've beaten Nam Gloria, who's the Russian B squad, quite comprehensively. Um, oh, taking up a letter. That's what you're trying to say. You're trying to say yeah, the that... team is now the Russian B team. They 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 are certainly aiming to prove that. Um, we'll see if they can pull it off and take it into the finals. Let's have a look at Justice, who is in a one v one against the Sabushi. Oh. No boo. No, never mind. Okay, two random light attacks. Arrow strike. Fire flask. No flask. <laughs> <laughs> That's being safe. Don't get the arrow strike before you die. No, no. Oh well. Oh. As I said, bad, he's man. saving it for next for next game. Saving it. For yeah, he'll game. get it at the I start of the next game and then for the opening fight. Best time That's how it works, right? Um, oh, 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 you guys don't yeah, remember man. the old elimination days, do you? No. Uh, in elimination, like every round reset all your feet, so you had like triple projectiles flying away, facing on Orochi. <laughs> I was just very common. It was insane. Just, just think about it. If you unlock a fire flask early enough, you just throw it every, every. I round. remember when we experimented with scrims where everyone started with all their feet. Yeah. Yeah, that and was uh, to try to to try to make it where renowned and in the in the game like super early, and then it was just like you had the opening fight at Citadel, and it was like Warmonger tier fours and fire flasks for the very first fight. Yep. Yeah. It's basically just use them as quick as possible. Um, so I assume it went swimmingly well. Well, we're not still doing it. So <laughs> we tried it, with, we tried it yeah. with no feats. We tried it with all feats. If you can, if you can change the rules. 
rolls around in the menu somehow. Ooh, we tried it. Just getting pings from places. So I'm trying to work out what that is. Let me pull up the brackets. On There's the a there a link for the bracket somewhere. In uh, seconds, if you type bracket in chat, should work. Yeah. Uh, exclamation mark bracket. There but we go. I'll have it Put on it in stream there. in a second too. Uh, we that was the first one. So we have a temple garden next. I don't know. I don't know much about EU. Who favored to win today? I mean. Well, Originally, it was, it was Namgoria. Uh, Russia B team. Yeah, from yeah, but now it's um, the Helvigan crew, crew, which is called uh, Extra Cool Gatchias. I, I don't really understand what that means, um, but yeah, they, yes. yeah, they they absolutely stomped Namgoria in uh, the first two, the first their, their matches. It was two zero, uh, but the first one was one of the most one sided matches I have seen in the Minion series that was with like an established team versus another team, not just like some people who just joined it. Um it was like they they lost one thousand and ninety three to ninety points. And they got one kill. Happens. Yeah. Um let's have a look. Next match. So yeah, I mean it does happen, but uh and they they did better in the second one, but it was still very much a stomp. Um so if they if the Heaven crew can keep that up, then Nam Gloria not looking like they're going to make it to the finals. But we've seen bigger turnarounds before, so sure, everything. Maybe, they, maybe this is a Russian mind game. Yeah, yeah, that's right? exactly. Just, <laughs> that's it. They were letting them think that they had contracted a CBS camp block syndrome, but in fact they have not. Can't, can't Paris syndrome as well. Um, And can't rotate. I mean, they just and they 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 pushed the right way, but it was like triple cap after triple cap, and they didn't manage to get. Yeah, you know, it doesn't wins, matter how good of decisions you make. If you lose every fight, it's not exactly, going to be yeah. pretty. You yeah, can make yeah. all the smart, intelligent. You should go here and do this, and if you lose when you get there, it doesn't matter. Exactly. I mean, they. I mean, it was a, it was partly the snowballing nature of things as well. There was so much feat advantage that even when they had a few team fights where they probably would have won without, they didn't so that's just how it goes so i'm just gonna grab a drink been talking a long time three one here too i'll be interested to see if they do it. my drink has gone flat that's very sad they are gonna do three one i think it's a good strat uh i've i've started to like it more than two two i mean all the um i think every team we've seen today has been doing this um sorry i clicked the wrong one um what are you drinking spam uh, Dot Pepper. Ah, classic. Yeah, no. yeah, I've seen a lot of teams doing 3 1. We were doing some scrims last night uh, against a team assembled by Zod, and he did 3 1 every time on this map in particular. And this is going really badly. First fight for um, Inconsistus. Just like this gets revenge, but health totals are well, really in What you saw there. Besides not being able to block, what you saw there too was um, because Rod went and got A, and uh, the gamer for the orange team there went to B. Um, he got in faster, so they immediately had an outnumbered fight, and it took Rod longer to get all the way across the map, so they yeah. were able to build it up. But now it's four four, and it's slowly working itself into an uh, even fight. And then Rod has to anti-gank. He can do it. I mean, he can do it. We uh, uh, Like, the players, we've seen him do it before. He gets one. Yeah. Is he going to get the next one? And again, this point hasn't gone to either side yet, so there's no... If he dies, he's not feeding Defender around or anything. Um, oh, you got to get the timing right, man. Yeah. It's turning to that. Okay, you got to punish your parries as well. Well yeah. done. At least, gets the, oh. at least gets the kill. It's just oh, about good. enough damage. Yeah, I thought he was going to miss I it. I didn't think it would kill, yeah. Um, I think he was just about enough. And Rod goes off to heal instead. Sensible. Um, Marichal guns reinforced living. We'll keep a, keep a camera on him. 
There should be oh, another. Oh, nice award. dodge cancel there. That was really nice. Who can make the, the, the main point fight at the beginning of a match? The yeah, longest? the longest, yeah. Well, it's always going to be either Temple C or Overwatch C. Yeah, Those but fights. which oh, team I mean, can get the award for making I've it the longest fight and then C's. tapping it? Oh, yeah. yeah, Harbor C is the fight that never ends because you can just rotate there so quickly. That's a solid point. Lolly's going down. Good awareness from Marichal oh. to get the. To get the um, nice guard break, nice. actually, that times it properly this time. We've seen a lot of missed time guard breaks. I do not believe he timed that properly, but I believe that well, it worked out anyway. Yeah, it worked really out anyway. Early, yeah. Yeah. I think it, I think he actually literally caught the. I think he literally caught the guys. The hundred well, I mean, it, it was just the <laughs> counter GB. It was enough damage to. Yeah, to kill him on the counter so. GB. Yeah. That, that was a bump GB. There. There's going to be a lot of revenge on this. Nabushi. Marichal sitting at 90% revenge as well. Um, bleed him. I mean, I think even even bleed would, would give him revenge at this point. Um, although, not if he has tags. There he goes, oh. and he, he accidentally stick two tags on. Good parry from Chizron getting that um, stall. Rod, he, Rod absolutely lit up there. I mean, that, uh, Nabushi does. She doesn't have orange, but she has big damage regardless. I mean, on bleeding opponent. Minions. Yeah. yeah, I mean, Nabushi's do uh, uh, undodgeables on her, on a bleeding opponent do more damage than Goki's uh, heavy openers. Oh, and he bounces off the super armor of Demon of Demon Ball. Uh, nobody knows that that happens, but yeah, d you can't pin a super armored move. And uh, I mean, just Demon Ball makes sense, right? I mean, you know, you get two free heavies off of it, but yeah, man, go for the hug. That's the best yeah. move. I get it. Yeah, that would have been a probably dead if he'd got if he'd gone for heavy into heavy. I don't think you get heavy into unblockable heavy because it's too no. slow. But no, but you get heavy into heavy. Yeah, I mean, that would especially been... if you recognize it early enough when he GBs and you know, like he's he can't help but press the funny button. Nice parry. Nice parry. Home run button. Yeah. Nice. It's on the right. To kill. That one didn't kill. Yeah. Just keep hugging. <laughs> keep on hugging. All right, let's have a look at this one we won here. We've got a... You know, I <laughs> don't know why that Shugo doesn't get complained about more. By I mean, more people do players. complain about him, but... I mean, he has so many issues, right? And there's no yeah, but like I feel like, like there should inside. be like people in the Reddit streets with like picket signs and shit, and they're just they're not that yeah, concerned. They're just like going. I don't know, he seems kind of good. Like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, people do complain about Goki. He's just his mix-up is a regular parry, a parry, regular parry now, so nobody cares. Yeah, but he's yeah. he's got a bash. They should be complaining about him now. And he's got a dodge I mean, bash that does damage. It's actually messed up. <laughs> Nice yeah. awareness from the... Rod gets a Fire Flask out early, but oh. only hits one. Is he going to be able to catch? I mean, it's fine. You're going to use it he to does get the... here and win. Yeah. He does get the chase. Nice. He's going to get Rod. A for that, and then, or at least going to get a solid push out of it, and he's going to get Flask twice. Too many people save Flask until the very end of the game. Like, they're trying yeah. to oh, like only that. win with that thing. Like, he used it to <laughs> force oh, a push. Does still have iframes for that unblockable, though? I guess that's the top, of, top unblockables for you. I mean, he's still... He's got Famine Flag on him still. Uh-oh. The thing that that dodge didn't lose its iframe is on the wall. Dodge attacks don't lose iframes on walls. It's got proper... Ooh. Oh, really? It's Let's got go proper back. iframes. That's so odd. Come on, Rod. Let's see. Yeah, it's the candy. We, we just hope it is. Yeah, exactly. That's what it is. It's talking about candy rather than... <laughs> oh, he's got a long yeah, range yeah. longbow. Here's Mr. Living. Or he's living. He's just he's dropped the Mister. He's had a divorce or something. Um, but he's gonna. Is he? Uh, th th this would like be a tier four opportunity, right? He and Misfortune are no longer together. Yeah. And no stamina. Ah, oh, his opponent's got no got no stamina either, so he gets a free, free rotation. That's like seeing those, see that the, we saw that light bounce off his guard with the, that's the non-enhanced lights. Rod, I didn't think, realized that uh, 
Lolly's oh, I was holding revenge and <laughs> is holding it too long. Uh, he didn't realize that uh, Living had tagged him with the longbow, which is why he gave revenge, but turned out wasn't super important. Nice chase there from Living. Uh, from just I assume. Okay. Unfortunate. <laughs> Unfortunate. Um. All right, so we're looking at uh, breaking. They're going to go through. Well, they're pushing A, I guess. He should have. He should have waited to kill him so he can kill him in breaking. Yeah, probably. I mean, I, I get a feeling that's partly what he was doing, but decided not to. I don't know why I went for that hug then. It's longer than he could have got. And the heavy does more damage, and he didn't really need to heal that much. He fails the Juggernaut guard breaks difference. a couple of times. Doesn't really make a difference for him, though. Active is T4. Well, it's the last fight of the game as well, right? Oh, well, Lolly's so doing a really good job, though. Like, yeah, oh. this, this may have been a miscalculation. Slight there we go. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, what was it that the clutch says about you never you never don't get use out of that tier four? Um, that's actually the second time we've seen Living die without getting any use of his tier four in this tournament. I'm not commenting on that because I have many clips of me dying within <laughs> five minutes of activating that shit. <laughs> it, clutch and just think, disproving on stream. And just think, this is John Who, you know, with option selects currently in the game. I mean, he didn't see to, he didn't option select anything there. He just, yeah, that's just true. ate everything. Ate all, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and it, they actually got him his that got uh, him his tier four. <laughs> Wait, which which tier four was that? I was Marichal's tier four came out. Misses a longbow though and dies. I mean, like, even though this is sloppy, they they haven't really got anything. Nothing, nothing good's going to come of this. Um, we'll see. Cheese a row, raw. Rod is got. Uh, maybe, maybe he could, go. Maybe we could have popped this tier two and inspired himself. By the way, I'm not I sure. Mean... Does Mr. Living pride himself on being able to react to Paddy Flash? No, it's the only uh... explanation I can come up. Why not just option select them all the time? I mean, you'd option select even on Paddy Flash, right? Don't you? Um, okay, so that is the losers semi-final. Um, so I don't know, living oh, personally. Hannah, option select so by default are like a frame slower than a normal parry, right? No, I think so. Uh, you, you can't GB select uh, parry flash. I know that. I don't know about the other ones. I think you can bash select on parry flash. We should be like with a macro. I think you should be able to, right? I mean, isn't that reason why flash, some uh, from some hit stuns you can't zone options like with normal parry, right? Like uh, some something extra. Oh, but that's that's because no, that's you can normal parry, but. Yeah, you can. You I'm can saying. still. If you zone options let, you can still parry. You just can get guard broken out of it as well, because they have the hundred ms guard break vulnerability on on the zones. You can guard break options let those ones instead, though. So, what am I thinking of then? I think you're I thinking know. of the frame, like the hit stun ones that you can't option select because you, they don't beat faint to guard break, but they still do parry if you if you throw if you zone. No, 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 no. That okay. doesn't, doesn't matter. Okay. But yeah. I don't know in that case. Um, okay, so we have the losers final. There's Nam Gloria against Inconsistus. And they have not had a fought so far this tournament. Let me have a look. So Nam Gloria have not fought um, Inconsistus yet. Yet Inconsistus um, lost 2 1 to Extra Cool Gatchias, and it was very close 2 1 as well, actually. Um, I mean, there was one game that was was more was, was more one sided. This is the final one, but the uh, the second one was very close, and the first one was quite close as well. Um, not waiting on this match. Okay, let me just follow up with a few things. So, yeah, we'll be waiting on the eye for a little bit. Um, I mean, well played from um, these these guys. Um, yeah, actually, yeah, I have to admit, it's also nice to see Jang Jun coming in. 
or and you know, I think particularly Berserker especially because I think uh, I don't know how people have been evaluating Berserker in the competitive scene. You know, just because like you know it's Berserker. You know, the hyper armor is great, but still kind of relies on those lights of his. But it was really great to see you know Berserker perform out there. Yeah, I mean for um, the longest that... sorry, sorry. Uh, for the longest sorry, no, time no. it was always uh Baros Berserker. That's it. Mm. That's the only that was the, the standard. If you can't play it to his standard, then why why do you bother? And if Baros <laughs> doesn't fall it out, why would anyone else? That was always yeah. the Yeah the thought plan. But now people choose it and I mean, I don't know what the fuck Baros is doing right now, so Ooh. I haven't seen scrims <laughs> of him in, in such a long time, so I don't know. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's a strange thing, aren't they? I don't know. It was always like the 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 underaged nemesis that's been playing, right? Yeah. I think I'm gonna yeah. get all of y'all's here. Y'all be safe, eh? Bye bye. Oh, uh, it is. You guys, let me know if you hear the siren. By the way, <laughs> you got a, a storm. Yeah, I have a storm, and uh, fire station is like 200 meters away from me, so I always hear that siren. Uh, okay, just didn't, just didn't make sure you're hunkered down well enough. Didn't Clutch say that uh, Barak won't be picking Zarkma? I mean, we we asked him yesterday, um, Thursday, and he said that Barak wasn't feeling it. But maybe Barak changes mind in between now and the, the majors. I mean, there's there's still a decent amount I mean, of time. Clutch We've got two has weeks. been uh, scrimming with Zerka. Yeah, I should say it's three weeks till the majors after today. So. It's time. There's time for the meta to change between the um, majors and the and the um, the qualifiers. In fact, I think they did. Um, oh, thanks for sorry. Thanks for joining us, Kyle. I I didn't see uh, you. I didn't hear you leave. Sorry, but thanks for joining. Um, yeah, there's there there is time for the meta to change between the majors and the and the qualifiers, and we've seen that happen a few times in in this series, really. Um, I think in stage one, the comps change between the qualifiers and the finals, if I remember correctly. Um, See, I think Barak is actually paying his team to run Zerker since he can't run <laughs> Zerker himself. <laughs> Sometimes the meta is fixed for what seems forever. Mm. The next time it just randomly changes with like no character changes just because one person all of a sudden tries something and then the other people stop being stubborn. We have eyes. I mean, there's a certain degree of experimentation that the yeah. game isn't uh, so uh, like the scene's not so big that we have enough time for everything to be to be um sorry, there's an alarm going off in the background. Yeah. Other things like yeah, a lot of the Russian teams. Plays uh, play uh, Glad right? I just yeah. stuck with him. Like Dero and Baron, these two guys are playing Gladiator, and you don't see yeah. anybody well, else. Baron right? always plays. Um, Baron always plays assassins. Just he's played Orochi and Gladiator and um, what's the face? Book Nusha. Um, so yeah, I, I guess if they. Always play like those kind of characters, and they don't follow the meta. And and being being good on a character has a big impact on whether or not you will be able to succeed in the meta. You know, if I if you switch over to a meta character that you do, that you don't play well, then you know if you keep on trying to deflect, if your muscle memory is keep on trying to deflect with Warlord, you're going to have a bad time, aren't you? No, I think you hit the hit hit the nail on the hammer right there. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it's a good exactly. phrase. Yeah, <laughs> he's, he's saying that I'm chatting shit. <laughs> 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 All right, let's see how this rotation goes. We got the standard <laughs> three, 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 one. Hi, Hulk UK. So Hiran did not have a good match uh, uh, earlier, so we'll see if he re redeems himself. Nice oh, damage on Justice there. So much damage. Holy yeah, it does so much damage. It's, it's <laughs> nutty. And it, Justice has already gone down thanks to that. Yeah. They get another one. Another one. No, not quite oh, in range. Should have dodge cancelled that into a forward dodge heavy. Um, and that would have caught. I think it in general is really hard 
to judge whether you're going to reach or not. Well, yeah, because nothing, because the damn thing like moves out. Yeah, especially like, in minions. It's weird how it has this, and they pushed onto. What was okay? And a rock. Yeah. Yoga is then trying to escape. You really, it's very hard to get away from from Zerka nowadays. I mean, it's a good thing. Oh, I messed up the deflect there. That that's gonna hurt. And he's Cause... fighting in the drop zone. Oh. Will it make a difference? Because he's... Nope, it won't. Yeah. Uh, expect it to forward light. And then yeah, yeah. Dead. At least it didn't uh, feed Defender a noun for them. So, I mean, a roughly even start for these teams. Um, I'm not sure we could say who's got the advantage at the moment. Even on, even on Renown. Uh, Inconsist has lost... Apparently, not got as many kills, but the renowns looking about similar. Uh, let's get in close. Again, big damage coming out on Just Dice, which living gets big. Ooh. Heavy. Just Dice could have like gone after here and then and got big damage on him, but instead he gets to go out and heal. You gotta run. Yeah. Thanks, guys. Need to make a call out. Yeah. Delivery service or some shit. Yeah. Vic is doing really well to survive in that with all those attacks flying out. Oh, God. <laughs> oh that was a that was a drop attack opportunity true. there. Um, that was a weird whiff. I thought he would dodge him, but uh. And if uh Just Ice had been on the uh on the ball he could have got a drop attack on the Goki. Um, but wasn't paying attention. And now we have. So look, get back into here. Nice. That should be. A... I was surprised he didn't go for the the heavy then, and then dodge cancel out the recovery of it. But I guess Rob would have got nice clack zerk gank. We see that. Ha that's uh, did it happen? Someone's got some weird things in the speakers. Whoever that is, I would request that you don't. Is it Zume? You need to mute yourself. We've got a lot of stuff in the background. I think that was an off-target dodge attack as well. Nice play from Marichal. Oh! Light parried. Again, Inconsistus taking, like, a lot of kill. <laughs> dying. He wasn't I mean, going to It's now, in terms of Renown, it's then getting a lot more in, in the uh, Numb Gloria's favor. Like, no kills for a for most of the of this team, but the points are very close. I think we'll end up seeing it play out like um, these sort of classic Citadel Gate games, where even though one team is having like no no kills, but will Rod chase Yogurt? We're going to see him. He there? Do you see? He went around the corner. This is so Ooh. weird. Yeah, it's like the fifth time now we see that. Oh yeah, no, that uh, they do be zooming. He always decided he's, he's not not going to push into A. I mean, this is going. It's going to go back and forth like this. It looks like neither team is going is pushing mid. They're pushing the other yeah. opponent's home points. But uh, and then Gloria winning every team fight. Like, oh, sorry, one one. Rod is the only one with real kills. Yeah, I think then Gloria will probably be like the like they'll probably have the easier time like getting access to their feet really quickly yeah. compared to others. Rod picked up another one. Keeps he keeps seeing. Well, I mean, that's what stats is. But he's only got his tier one either. Like, I mean, yeah. he's not getting any one v one. He's just getting these snipes, so he's not getting assassin on. I mean, I mean all know. of them seem kind of feed staffed at the moment, right? Yeah, because you're fighting in mid. They don't have this, like, don't have yes. defender renown. Exactly. Nobody pushes the home point. No extra <laughs> renown. There's like no opportunity. Yeah, I'm just gonna quickly mute at zoom in rock because I think you're. Okay. A lot of, uh, just a lot of uh, weird noises coming out. It's rather, even if it was only for my sake, a little bit and nauseous with it. <laughs> whatever it is that, whatever it is that's going on in the background there. Sounds like you're. I don't. I don't want to say anything. <laughs> that's okay. No, 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 go on, Spence. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's something that wouldn't, uh, in terms of. I don't know, does Twitch have that shit anymore? <laughs> Do we have anything that's just... Everything's allowed by now. 
It's fine. Oh, it's like, oh, we'll look at those. Um, see those? That, that's the bug with Goki's target swapped heavies. They, the animation comes out on one side, but they look like they. People have adapted to that quite well. Yeah, I mean, it has got a long animation anyway. It's just. Yeah. It's just people are weary of it and they block left. Wait, Again. adapted to what? So Goki has a bug where if you target swap and throw a regular uncharged heavy, you oh. it comes out. Uh, it looks like it's locked onto the other person, but it's not locked onto you. Just the combo ones, is it? Uh, all of them? Yeah, just the combo ones. Sorry, sorry. Oh, okay. Let's say that. Um, and then you, and then yeah, it has no. Oh, nice. Yeah. Actually, I'm glad you pointed okay. that out about the target swapping, where it looks like he isn't targeting you, but he he can. You know, he is with the, with the target swapping because I have done this as Hidakiri too. You know, when I charge up my unblockables, the similar thing happens where basically I'm facing I'm facing someone, but the moment I target swap, it, it still looks like I'm facing away from them until like the last uh, few frames of the hit. Well, I mean this doesn't even look like the last doesn't even look like any frames yeah. of it target swap. It just it just looks completely like it's facing the other person. Like one hundred percent. Um and I think we're still looking like it's very even on points, but look at the kills. Uh, although yeah. kills have evened out a little bit, and renowns still about the same. I mean, I guess it really could go either way. Still, um, they've not managed to capitalize on it enough that they will have such a such a massive feat advantage. Oh, I guess it's the, um, here and going down. Oh, now they take the. No, oh. they push. I, I'm not sure. I mean, it's two people dead, but push. if they're not killing them quickly enough here, yeah, then you're gonna have all the respawns, and immediately you will be disadvantaged and feed. Yeah, massive and feed the defender. Uh, no, uh, no, yeah, no, yeah, no, yeah, yeah. Living needs to. Yeah, they need to get the fuck out. Yeah, they, exactly they've, they've. Oh, and no, yogurt gets the kill, but again, no, no. Yeah. Right now, I mean, like, I need kills the yogurt on now, but already he's on six kills, and he hasn't got his tier two. Assassin round is fine, guys. And look at the tier. Look what his tier two. He's running though. He's running the executioner's respite one. What? <laughs> Doesn't Zerker have one of the fastest executions in the game? Though? Yeah, but like, who cares? <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah, you could get famine flag. Oh, stop calling a famine flag. It's not real. It's not real. <laughs> So now, with the defenders, mid's going to go back towards. Yeah, I don't think we're going to see a single tier four. No, I highly doubt it. Until the end. Um, which is bad. For Maybe it sucks. Oh, minion. <laughs> minion hits done. Meaning he gets parried. I mean, the Marichal might be close to us. Oh, it will be Very now. Visible. It just gets a nice. Uh, yeah. Sorry, I. Fight drags out. Oh, wow, um, actually, actually oh shit, that's really, really bad breaking Holy. for them. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Mr. Surprise, they actually managed oh. to kill Oh, yeah, well, they're going to count that for we... Oh, no. Well, I mean, nope. even so, this is not the point they want to, they need to, they need to capture toward, to unbreak. So, actually, this is looking like Inconsist is going to take it. I mean, they'd There's have to. Tier two. They'd have to do really poorly in this. He's saving his tier two for next game. What the fuck is he doing with it? Well, I mean, he's in the middle of fighting, he's got a... <laughs> he okay, someone, start. someone was either urinating or they were, like, no. pouring themselves something. That was a freeze point. That was a freeze point. Yeah, everybody knows that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> when, he's not, when he's not pissing on the player base, he's uh, pissing on the cup next to his death. I mean, I went to one of the freezes frame check streams, and it went on for, like, ten hours, and he just pissed in the middle of it in the cup. <laughs> <laughs> to keep the stream going until he said. All right, I'll unmute uh, Zetsu two now. Uh, um, sorry, Zume, you you had some really like it sounded like you were fisting a tin full of spaghetti. It, like <laughs> it wasn't great. Um, well, well, that that was you know. So really, look at the the kills here. Like, I mean, Heron had another bad game, but overall, it was really close until right at the end. Yeah. Well played, well played for Inconsistus. Um. Uh, two one now. Damn. Oh, yeah, the, uh, yeah, it felt like a really long drawn out game for them because it was always made, always made, yeah. always made, and nobody really wanted to push. Yeah, until and then and then they did, and then that's it. Um, all right, wait for the eyes to come back. Yeah, I mean, yeah, they, they pushed, just... but then they got punished for it. But somehow in the end, the mid fight uh, turned it for them again. Yeah, yeah, so, I think yeah. That's, 
I think they maybe pushed off and they didn't have enough time to go. And I think I probably want to watch that one over again to see where it all fell apart for them. Um, that'd be one that's where a VOD review would be very valuable. All right. Will be available. Oh, planning the uh, next dojo session. Event. I'll export it directly to YouTube. So we'll skip the uploading part. I'm not even recording. That, that Mancho, Mancho Zero, I forgot his name, but yeah, he, he really busted his hump for that. <laughs> That's the brackets. Oh yeah, sorry, uh, Zuma. I don't know. Like it wasn't. <laughs> it wasn't meaning to be uh, to be offending you. With my. Oh no, no, it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> oh, that's better anyway. I, mean, like, I don't know what it was. It was just. Yeah, just. Like, I mean, you're quite easily distracted by like random noises. But so... it always acts like he's so nice and kind, but then when he sees <laughs> the opportunity. <laughs> I mean, well, I, 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 muted. Please... Six days, moronic. <laughs> <laughs> but, but, please, but please it makes sense I, I mean I, I mean I said this before filthy Spaniard filthy yeah. Spaniard we know yeah. it's filthy yeah. behavior exactly filthy morals filthy mind <laughs> yeah what was that uh, I can't describe what your mic sounded like or I'll break the terms of streaming <laughs> And then I did it anyway later on. Uh, oh, so... <laughs> we're getting demonetized. And we're, we're not monetized to start off with. All right, so 2 1 for. It's, sorry. Sorry, it is 1 0 to Inconsistus. Um, we'll see how this game goes. A very different kind of map. You don't get the sort of backwards and forwards between um, home point and mids in this map. It's much more wide. So we'll see. Oh, this is the first 2 2 split we've seen. All day. They've always been going 3-1. Which is interesting because people always take usually 3C and either 1 mid or 1A. So I wonder if this is going to be bad for them early on. Oh, it's Providence. Your, your mic is going off again now. Um, oh, no, it is? Yeah, a little bit. Uh-oh. That's right. You can just use push to talk or, um, you know, mute yourself when you're... Uh, if you... If you uh, yeah, sure, I can do that, I can do that. Let me just go back out, and I'll just come back in. Hiram has got revenge. And this could... Oh, nice. There we go. And that is living. Living is no longer. Up that. Up that. Um, they're outnumbered, but there's a huge health difference. Oh, right no. Nice one. Oh, nice. He's deflected out the execution punish, and that should take the team fight for them, really. Um, oh, <laughs> figures came in. Oh, that's not what we want to see. That was. Uh, someone should have called out who was going to do the guard break then. I mean, that should be a clear order, right? The one that hits first will do the duty. Yeah. But I mean, instead, they just. Uh, oh, I don't know what they just did. And uh, Rod oh. goes. Rod goes off. He's just, oh, he's just had enough of it. She's still not owned. By she's still taking. I mean, we've seen longer ones so far. There was one that lasted a long. It took lot. Took them long. There was one match where it took them longer to cap C than it took um, Nam Gloria to lose against the Helvigan squad. You won't let that one go, huh? <laughs> I mean. You gotta keep it spicy, right? <laughs> it was really, really quite something, to be honest. Uh, like, he, I just it haven't was seen. Was surprising, yeah. yeah. It was very surprising. Um, no, living exactly again right. takes. Jade just fucking rage sometimes. Marichal looking very low, and this is look there, again. Ooh. This is, they messed that up for. There we go. Uh, Providence, it's your popping a lot. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, uh, but now, yeah, please, mute better? yourself. Just, just mute yourself until, unless you have got something to say. Okay. And defender renown. What? I mean, renown looking fairly even. Sorry, I'm just. Uh... <laughs> we had spectating all there, but you know. Stretching. Yeah, just, just enjoying. Oh, nice out of lock punish there. Gets the. I mean, there's the the meta is entirely full of characters that you find it very difficult to disconnect this 
is this a good pick? I don't think it's a good push. Um, um, yeah, going for the the Goki one v one. No, it's not close enough to get. Oh, and squeak, squeak. let's see where the rotations are coming from. Yeah, Rod's coming to rotate. Uh, Hiran's there as well. I mean, I just get off the point at this point, right? He'll try it. Goodbye. There you go. I mean, he dies for it though. Um, and living the is not battle. Being... <laughs> living is not having a good match this one actually. Look, he's uh. Oh, Owen oh, fall. No, no, that's oh, objectives. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, my bad. One three. Yeah, Obu's one. I can two, read so. numbers. <laughs> Yogurt trying to get on the point to, to defeat the veteran now. <laughs> Question mark. I mean, I said I think earlier this is a possible escape. Yeah, I think that's probably. I think you're probably right. I mean, I said earlier that this is unlikely to be a, a match where it goes like one side, you know, back and forwards into in like in the mid lane. But actually, that's that is what's happening um, most of the time. They are just like nice parry from Vickers, uses it to get on the point. Yeah, no engagement is in there. So look at how it's going in mid. Lots of uh, Chinese being yelled out. It's JJ takes a nap. I love commentating sometimes, but <laughs> <laughs> I mean, uh, it's just a horrible gremlin face. What can I say? Um, clearly used it to intimidate his foes. It's a weird fight down by the ladder. Yeah, I was about to say, like, why is everyone? <laughs> gravitating towards this one now. I mean, maybe they're hoping that they can get enough is... health loss that they can then go and push the push it on to the point. Like now, with Fikus being very low, now is when you think they want to go. One, yeah, now one, they one. want to come. Oh, but then, like, now yeah, they want to yeah, go. Yeah, oh, no, 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 they're out of time. He comes in angry from me. From the I mean, they're falling. all low. Yeah, and they're all falling back. And Rod, oh, Rod's kind of pushing there. That's. I mean, you can try. Oh, he tried. Oh. <laughs> yeah, he. That was a. Uh, in between me seeing that I wanted to spectate him and looking at him, he lost his entire health bar. Um, that's uh, actually a well-executed Goki gank. I mean, they does a lot of damage with him. How's now looking now? Against, I mean, it's still pretty balanced. I mean, surprised about the kills. I thought. Uh... Van Gloria would have yeah. had way more kills. Really, it's all looking quite quite evenly matched. Points wise, again, it's about the same. I mean, this uh, is not easy to call. I can't really make heads or tails of who's winning or losing. Yeah, there's a lot, like last one as well. This could go. This yeah. could go either way at the end. Um, and I guess are we looking at getting any T fours by the end of the game, other than a couple? Or do you think the renowned's gaining too slowly? I don't know. It depends. It could. They could. If they have one big push onto a point. Then you could end up with one team getting a lot of defender renown. Um, Ficus is not too far off his tier four. If he boosts a bit, he'll probably get it. Um, no ladder shenanigans going on over there. Oh, they can't. Yeah, unlikely. Nice pressure. No, it's the same point. Oh. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Me messing up team killers typically. That's all right. Let's have a look how things are going here. Core blind. Yeah, so we got two and mid. are breaking. <laughs> I mean, they need to clear mids quickly, which I think they will be able to. Oh, yeah. that be right back. Yeah, the thing is, now that now they've clean, they've cleared it. It will go. It'll pretty much go in their favor unless uh, Nam Glorious literally sit here and 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 make sure they farm all the minions, which is not easy to do. So, I mean, it could quite easily go. Right the other way around, and then Inconsistence could bring it back if, if um, yeah, I really, I really couldn't say which way. See, see we've got mid has gone in their favour. They are very close to. Hearing, hearing if not careful, could be killed as they are breaking. This is really risky. I don't know if he was trying to save it for that. He does manage to get it, but he's not running Bounty Hunter, so he's still super low. This is a really, this is a really good push now. Look, no, basically they're breaking with hardly any health. Uh, two of these are like, you know, one pixel. He's dead. He's 
unrevivable. Tier four sure? come out that's now. The, that's the tower. Goki's gonna die. Well, they... Like they have. Yeah. They have to stop Ooh. Obu clearing mid, and that's the only thing that could. Who and he decided he didn't want to. Okay, well, uh, there we go. Just went to... The fact could just go from. Can you look at me? Full HP to zero with one flask. Oh, okay, fair enough. Wait, yeah. I think he was thinking that if he it didn't wasn't a flask, by the way, it was a. Um, oh, he was thinking yeah, if he didn't go to the point, so. they they well they 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 already they had it. So like, oh, I don't know. Anyway, that was. I think like they're about to die. He had to get on the sea to stop the cap, but at the same time, if they get the cap, then him clearing mid did nothing, and they're all dead anyway. Yeah, yeah. Catch twenty two. But that's so. That's is that two matches to inconsistence then? Yes. That's two zero. The inconsistence take it, and then Gloria are out. That was Beachhead. Left the bracket. Beachhead and Overwatch just now. And again, really, really close all the way up until the end, and then. I think this often happens when you have these matches where it's going like where there's this back and forth um in in between mid mid lane you you often have it so there's like um breaking and then it ends very quickly after that. I, I noticed... think that is uh, a team thing not being able to identify the times they could push like a, a better team quote unquote would actually see these opportunities and push the home points or just like Cal put it just muscle them down and then push the home point you actually that think is... it's something more intrinsic to how the game goes on oh, my game the game's crashed um i think it's something more intrinsic i've seen matches like that like what happens is you they get into breaking with momentum and it's not rather than rather than having like a situation where okay we're ready for breaking breaking is like sort of thrust upon them and then often it, it's like the the, end, the tail end of a team fight that that goes. I'm I'm gonna have to, to quit out my game because it's it's just died. Um, yep, it's not responding. In the meantime, so we'll be going on to grands because that was the winners' finals, uh, losers' finals even. Uh, it's extra cool. Uh, extra cool gachias versus inconsistus. So this one was very close. Uh, at least two of them were very close matches. And now we'll see if they are managed to be very close again. Yeah, uh, I think yeah, I think it's something intrinsic to those kinds of situations where you have low um, renowned games with this sort of backwards and forth. And it's often <clears throat> it's often the team that loses tends to be the team that is probably doing it again. I'm gonna have to mute you. Um, uh, it's it's the team that loses is normally the team that was just ahead about 800 points, and they lose mid, and then mid goes the other direction because you can't really counter farm that, and then it, um, and then they sort of just run away from that because it's it's always the mid fight where they break through mid. Um, and the only times I've seen teams avoid that kind of loss is when they then send one person to back cap just as they are losing mid. And then that tends to pull the opponent's focus away from mid. And if they can get the back cap, then obviously that's great. And if they don't, then at least they don't have... They aren't like entering breaking in a mid fight in a in a team fight that's already going against them, or they're already at low health. So, I think I've seen Russian mind games do that quite a lot. We saw those yeah. in those those like really close temple games where it was back and forth in mid the entire time, and then suddenly Dero goes round and and steals steals their home point, um, at that point when they didn't realize what was going on. Yeah, interesting point. Can rewatch a couple of these recordings and yeah. check. Um, them. Yeah, I would say a, a, a one that really like followed that trend to me was the last game that in the previous major which Nemesis lost on on um, Sank Bridge. It was very much like really close, and then they just had a really bad breaking, and they 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 entered breaking with two dead, and mm -hmm. that's just how it goes. And I was like, at the time, I was when I was watching, I was thinking, oh that. They really got to do something about mid because this is going to go. They're going to be. They're going to lose mid 
well, they've lost mid and it's going to go to the opponents um, and they're going to be in breaking at the same time. And that's exactly what happened. Um, just like we saw with this one, but I get on a linear map rather than this wide map that is um, Overwatch. But I guess if you play them like a, a linear map where you have one point that you never push into the enemy's point, it's always back and forth, a little tug of war. And then the team that's on top when you get to when it gets to breaking is the one that's going to have a big advantage. Right, come on, game back up again. We'll see who, what maps we are. Okay, they've had a bit of a. It's had some confusion over the the team process banned low seed so we have high four is banned the pick is overwatch temple citadel and we need two more picks we are waiting on them right I'll start streaming against discord i'll unmute providence but yeah Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah, I, I, your your mic again is very. Like, you just robotic. assign a key for push to yeah, talk just... for a while. It's okay. It's okay. But is it good now? Is it like still popping no. up or what? No, it's not good. Just just oh. put on put yourself on push to talk and mute yourself unless you're like specifically going to say something. That's okay. Don't worry about it. But but thank you. Thank you for that. <laughs> no <you>. worries. <laughs> uh, you know what I'm actually con uh, um. Uh, you know, uh, intrigued about is a recent development that, you know, uh, Sony Interactive Entertainment did. Uh, I'm not sure if you all have seen the, uh, the, the, the page that I posted up a while back, but it showed that Sony actually put up a patent which would allow our online tournament systems to be integrated into their uh, gaming network. So for that. I well, did read, but not the full article here. Yeah. I don't but like yeah, game was one happy, right? Yeah, I don't like it's the idea. uh it was kind of mixed because yeah, it, it basically made it so that as far as like, you know, uh tournaments go, it's kind of just consolidating mainly on one platform, which yeah. you know just isn't really yeah, it's kind of I mean, as much as I'm a, a patron of Sony games, you know, like even have to kind of say it's kind of a it's a it's kind of shitty. It's a massive dick move, we'll put it that way. <laughs> um, yes, yes, exactly. I mean, companies are going to take whatever advantage they can get. Yeah. If they get away with it, then that's how it is. If they don't yeah. get away with it, yeah. they make a statement, oh, we're so sorry. And then the next three times they do get away with it, and then they're not sorry. It's yeah. just how it is. Yeah. I mean, look at the, the whole Blizzard shit. And yeah, like, it's, uh, it's Microsoft getting, uh, yeah. like Microsoft getting Bethesda, I think, right? Yeah. Yeah, but it's just, just how it is. It's Yeah, um, it is. yeah well, I hope they don't um, get that patent granted. And if they do well... I, I, can yeah, they, I know, can they even I do that? Like, if it's, if there's other things that have already, you, I, mean, I mean, luckily it only affects PlayStation, right? Because they are talking specifically about their own, like, it'll, it'll only affect PlayStation and Xbox. It'll only affect consoles because. I mean, their... uh, I, noticing, I have been noticing lately that on their own YouTube channels, they have begun a lot more streaming on, uh, you know. Uh, Competitive games, particularly, uh, you know, fighting games, they've been doing that a lot more. Even though, even for games that are already uh, available on, you know, uh, other platforms besides themselves, but they, Do they have crossplay on those ones. Those have crossplays, but on their streaming channels, I have not seen them. Like again, I haven't really been able to confirm that, but I do know that those games already have crossplays. Like Mortal okay. Kombat 11 has crossplay. Uh, I believe so. Uh, wait, QK, does Soul Calibur 6 have crossplay? Uh, I don't think so. Yeah, I can't confirm that. I know Mortal Kombat 11 definitely allows for crossplays. And PlayStation hosted tournaments for those uh, lately. Oh, well, good, I guess. I mean, I don't see how a tournament would work if they've got it locked to their. A crossplay tournament would work if they've got it locked to PS Plus by this patent nonsense. And yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right about that. So. Like, mm -hmm. I don't know what I don't know what they're doing about that. Really, sounds yeah, sounds sus. I dislike yeah. that concept. 
from what I read on the IGN's article, at least, it says here the patent notes that it would use a gaming network platform that players are required to have an account for to register for these online tournaments. But whether it's referring to the PlayStation Network or an entirely new service from Sony has yet to be confirmed. I mean, there's not going to be anything other than the PlayStation Network, will it? So That's what I think, right? <laughs> What else? But uh, yeah, yeah, like uh, I, I have to agree with a couple of things. Like, if it's just limiting to that, then you know that's it's really limiting the scope of what a tournament can be. Yeah, um, and hopefully people will uh, ignore that shit and uh, <laughs> and tell them to yeah. go go suck a fat one. Um, yeah, yeah, it's kind I of. I mean, a, if tournament like... organizers are forced to go through that network, then well, like, people might as well be forced to just use it. Otherwise, they can't. Well, they, can't yeah, stop, I mean, they can't stop you do they can't stop them having running a tournament like like with via... their with their platform sure why not no they can't like how can they stop them organizing games outside of it via battlefield for example there's literally nothing the way they can do they can you do sure, that. Can't do that. sure yeah, they can't can they? do anything about how their product is used or well, how could they like they, unless know. they are know. deciding i mean it's basically <laughs> you're organizing custom matches with your friends like yeah, so what but, if the sure and then you get slapped with a lawsuit from someone. I mean, that would be and massive. Will... Yeah, sure. No, no, uh, is it? Is it? They have been granted the patent. It's, it's uh, right then, right? No, they've well, only then... filed it, but they haven't been granted it yet. But even if they grant... but is it, I mean, obviously, it is a dick move and everything. That it's morally no. very ambiguous. Let's put it like that. But yeah, even yes, if they granted... can do it, right? No, no, because they granted the patent on so a software that does a particular thing. Doesn't mean that you can't do that particular thing via another, via any other path that's using doesn't use our software. Like if you, if they say uh, if you Uber, want to for use example, our platform, our, with platform, I mean the, the console. If yeah, you want then, to use it this way, you need to use this thing we provide. They if haven't. You they haven't got a. That's an entire. That would be in the in that would have to be in the user, um, end user agreement for the, of, so, yeah, for, sure. the, for the for the console. I mean, they I mean, could it try will, and do that. It will not affect uh, like. Oh, I'm, I'm having a tournament in my local town here, whatever. <laughs> yeah. They don't care about that shit. But huge things that attract sponsors like Evo and that kind of shit, that they're interested in. I mean, that would be... Imagine if they did that. Like, okay, basically, Didn't we have... Sony to... just buy Evo? Yeah, Sony actually uh, co-owns Evo now. Oh, well, well, So they're thinking to... ahead further. Well, but yeah, I mean, they want to monopolize that thing. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. Yeah. It's a good way to get everybody else to stop... Going to Evo and have new, new, have a new organization. <laughs> I mean, that's come that's up exactly what Riot it. Games did. ESL is not allowed to host uh, um, legal, League of Legends tournaments for years now, just because they monopolized the whole shit. It's, it's their, their game and everything. Okay. All right, I'm going to go on mic. Oh, yeah, sorry. You know, in case the popping is, in case yeah, you know, you guys hear on my end. Ah, cheers. Nice guard break then from Living to catch the recovery of that. These keep no. landing so much. Yeah, I mean... And he's also not afraid to use it, like, mid-team fight. I mean, if you've got peel for your, from your allies, or that you can tell the opponents aren't paying attention, then you... I guess you can use them. Yeah, um, sure, sure, sure. Moki's eating... Oh, my <laughs> goodness, Moki just <laughs> eat three of those in a row. But the rest of the team fight's not going in their favor. Um, like, Marichal's super low... Um, just ice about half. Right? It's two, two against three. I think they're gonna get rotated on, aren't they? Um, how's Rod doing against Baron? Okay, yeah, you're right. No, that I was, I was, I just thought they had somebody else that they didn't have. And he ganked himself. Nice. <laughs> I think Rod woke up. He's gotten into the groove. We'll see. He lost a couple of one v ones against Baron when they were like with one Don't health. Don't jinx it again, Baron. Don't <laughs> jinx it again. Too there late, we go. He late. gets the, he gets his one v one. That's that's happened like three times, and he's made. Yeah, that's a really good that. start. Like both side points. Yeah. Oh no, the C oh, is nice. not taken. My bad. My the C bad. wasn't taken. They managed to get a rotation on here. Uh, presumably from Moki. Um, that's like this is like killing somebody very quickly in a team fight. Not necessarily a good thing. Um, because they can come back and especially yes. when you're not getting extra renown from it, they come back off spawn. And there um, was the hitbox again. In yeah, case, that's, like he's twice. doing that. He's doing it a few times. Nice damage coming out. And nope. <laughs> yeah, you can't escape from JJ, right? <laughs> yep. 
And now Rod is. Uh, I mean, he's got ninety. Uh, he's got ninety percent revenge. Is if they act, and Moki's here as well. So if they accidentally tag him, uh oh. Well, I spoke too soon. Um, it's really good to see JJ kind of climb back up on the relevancy ever since his uh his his changes dropped. Yeah, no, it's really nice. I mean, like it was it, it was only so he didn't really need a giant amount. Missed, again, missed on that guard break. They keep on doing that, like. And this is the difference that we see between these guys and oh dear, like whilst the, the Helgen guys and these guys both they're all playing rather well, and they this is this is not this won't this shit won't fly um, against the teams that are already qualified. Let's put it that way. Um, missing those missing those things, we've seen them cost them fights, and you you just can't. Be sloppy like that against you yeah. know, teams like Nemesis. And, like if you practice yeah, these ganks in, in matchmaking, a lot of people will try to parry and not option select parry or GB yeah. selected. But these guys will just GB select the, these external ones, and uh, which obviously just counter guard breaks automatically at the correct time. So yeah, you don't catch any parry attempts with the GB. So you need to uh, catch the correct timing. Yeah, and I've seen it. We've seen. I don't know, I probably said miss time that GB confirm. <laughs> I probably said that like <laughs> fifty times or something this this tournament. Mm -hmm. um, and yeah, like I said, it just when you when you run into oh, that was what correct timing there. Um, yeah, the Helvagen guys really woke up now. I think. Kills wise, they should be ahead. Uh, we'll look at the end of this one bit. Yeah. Well... <laughs> Cheeky. Let no ladder shenanigans. Pops on to. I mean, it's about even on kills. Really? Like, I'm actually, misjudging that so much. And uh, look, actually, the help, Baron's got one. He's got one takedown. He's doing really. He's got. I guess he's got two now. Um, I'm surprised he was pushing that. <clears throat> I mean, so far they haven't given up any kills. So no, don't leave the point. Don't let the point. Uh, is, come on, Rod is Rod is thirsty for for Baron here. He's <laughs> oh, nice. I mean, it's, it's always enjoyable watching Zerka. Um, just hearing the sound of JJ complaining in the background. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what? Oh, I think I remember seeing all numchipai means something. I don't know. Just ask Catalyst. I think it means something quite rude, actually. Um, <laughs> what? Uh, what he says when he chokes? Or. Uh, when he when he, he does kicks. the kick. The shin kick, yeah, when he does the shin uh, kick. Such carelessness, I think. Oh, oh I know he says Helvgen, Hompka's going to go down. Like, like Inconsistus here have got... Uh, they're doing quite well on kills and renown, but, like, points-wise, look, there's still quite a long way for them to go. Yeah, they lost uh, the, the mid-fight. Oh, nice. Oh, he's not dead. <laughs> no, he is dead. Okay, it was somebody else's, it was somebody else's icon below that we didn't... Uh, uh. You mean you mean the kick the kick quote, right? This one? Yep. Yeah. Uh it means you're incompetent. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> so rather rude. And another demon ball. Ah, and that's gonna, he's gonna be he's gonna no. be dead, right? No look at the uh the revenge. Yeah. Nice. Rod picks for another. Rod's been playing really well so far. Oh, I've, I've definitely spotted the wrong He's person. good at cleaning up. Yeah. I mean, look, how many kills has he got? Five takedowns. I mean, I guess it's better than better than everybody else. Oh, I said that. Living sitting out at nine. Um, oh, oh, dangerous place good. to be. Dangerous place to be against a character with a dodge bash. Um, Almost right through the zone bash. <laughs> and dice to nice the... scar break there. I mean, if you chained to heavy, that would have been that would have hit living. But so this, what do you think about this push here? Uh, they're gonna have, they're gonna get see. spawned. No, it's got to be a four v four. With yeah, so this is the kind of, to get out of here. Yeah, this is the kind of push that if they don't get out quickly. Oh, okay, good. There well, go. good stuff. There, they're paying attention to that. Yeah, good peel from Rod, letting his Marichal get get. Uh, they had a massive health disadvantage. They had two people at like twenty percent. Yeah. 
and the others were all respawning and coming in. That was a, oh yeah, that was a, it was a good. But I mean, they they need the points though, so they really need to get B. Might it was good to stop the point generation from them. Some. And, um, I mean, could have worked out, but they clearly identified it didn't, and they got out. Wouldn't wouldn't the best play for Marsha right now be to either wait out the team fight or kill himself? Yeah, probably kill himself. But this gank, this gank here is, I mean, that's shot, isn't it? Um, them way too long. And that's stopping them. That was all this time mid's been. I mean, man, yeah, I'm curious who was farming mid from the Hellbegin guys all this time. I don't know. Because they held mid for quite a while. I think it was just whoever was um who had it. Let's look. Maybe good now. rotations from them. Always going there, making sure they yeah, kept it. Yeah, could be. You yeah. Just pop in, pop in now. I guess I'll we've got tier fours on times. Moki, and Chlor is going to have his tier four in a minute. Like a hot minute. Um, these guys need to push mid here. And remember, really, they need to sort of win these team fights straight away. Clory's got his tier four. Three. We have three here now. That's a Fury Flask come out. You sure that was Fury? Needs to get that. <laughs> there was a. That was a soothing mist. Um, um, no, 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 no. Just trying to figure out who threw that flask. It was a uh, uh, Moki from from the 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 Helgen, Helgen's warlord from threw it from his own point. And this is oh, looking. I have a warlord. Ha! Dangerous place to fight. Wait! <laughs> they don't have a Goki though, so that's the uh, the difference here. Interesting. Marichal's trying to get up the ladder. He's isolated up here. I think he just does go down. This is the first one, right? Yes. The audio is a bit delayed on the stream. Oh, no no worries, man. It's happy. Discord. That was fucking bull. So slow. It's long enough for you to dodge it. Dodge it. Realize you dodged too early. And then get dodge it again, yeah. Well, Wait, I mean, they picked up that one quite well. Um, unlike the previous one where, uh, you know, against um, Nam Gloria, where I was going backwards and forwards, the um, Helvgen team had a lot more momentum through it. They were playing really well. Mm -hmm. I mean, actually, look at look at the, the kill count. Yeah. Like, they're, it's, if anything, they've got fewer kills um, and more deaths, but they just, I guess they've been rotating well. They, they were holding mid for longer. Um, and Renown is an advantage yeah, I think as well. Mid decided it here. Yeah. And I guess I mean, maybe... just, like, all of a sudden two people quickly uh, clearing it back to the fight. And... Oh, yeah. we weren't really observing mid, so I, I can't say for sure. Yeah, me neither, but... Um... But the point generation <laughs> came from mid, I'd say. Yeah, if, and if you look at the Renown... Mid, not far minute. Yeah, if you look at the Renown, they must have been killing minions as well, because, you know, um, if you, like, Rod there, you know, Marichal got fewer kills. I, I don't know. I think they yeah. must have been killing minions. Um, the, the meta has definitely moved away from the like you know mid heavy farming that it used to be, but mid is still very important. So maybe these guys just weren't paying enough attention to it. Um, this is one. So we have one nil for the Helvigan squad so far. I need to cheat here. One second. Phones off actually. To reload All right, there we go. Sense. Sorry, my ear was very itchy. <laughs> Decided I'm not going to wear headphones now. Uh, if I if my sound volume my quality goes down or you uh, you can't hear me, just tell me and I will switch back to headphones. For sure. now, I'm going to give my ears a break. And we have eyes. You need big headphones. Yeah. I mean, I hear myself, big... by the way. Oh, okay. Dang it. All right, well, I'll try and turn the volume down instead. Say something for me, please. Yeah. Like I said, you need big headphones. Yeah. With big ear, ear muffs, what's it called? Uh, actually, you know, I, I don't know. I don't know. I know that I Googled specifically that when I bought mine. Yeah. Cups or something? I don't know.
mean, when I look for headphones, I, I also consider things like sound quality, but... No, it's just size of the ears. Yeah, the edge of your ears against your hair, and then it itches. You know what the name of that Sorry, cross we're not all on elves. Moki's shield emblem is? Like that cross with the I haven't seen that before. I don't know what it is in English, no. Oh, you know what it is in German? No, neither. Oh. <laughs> just, just, just having an excuse. <laughs> Maybe I can reverse it myself. That's... Well, it I is pretty they're, common. Just, just, um, just describe it in Google and it probably show us the correct thing. The the team emblem is the, is the Valknut. Yes, that that I could have told you. Why well, just wanted to say Val? I want to say Valknut. So, um... <laughs> but I think. It's... Let me let me check. There we go. Oh yeah, it's the Russian Orthodox cross. Russian Orthodox cross. Okay, again, we got. Yeah. We have another three. One. Do you want to see the team fight or the one v one? I always want to see the team fight. Team fight yeah. We've watched one v ones a lot already. All right, fair enough. One v team fight. You're just jinxing Rod, anyways. <laughs> <laughs> well, in that case, you'll win this one. Um, nice deflect from Homker. Big. Nice running from Nice with someone and jinxing, jinxing the entire door. Moki, a bit low on damage. Marachal being like isolated in the corner there and eating several headbutts. I mean, his team comp. Oh, that's bad. You don't get revenge in this this kind of situation. I mean, this is definitely going in Helgen's favor with. Yeah, I even got revenge. Yeah. Hello. Yeah. Marachal goes down. And Living oh, left on his own. Will they. Tried to did dodge he choose Bash Selector? Maybe that's what he did, but he 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 certainly died for it. Oh, but Rod wins his one v one. Well done, Rod. I still don't know if, if we think that's a like a favored one v one for the Berserker or for the Gladiator. Like, I think it's probably. I don't want to say Zerk favored, but. It's it's tighter than it looks. I did a yeah. long set. They both have the tools to put each other out of commission. Nice deflect there. Yeah, I think the I think it might be tighter once the uh, the option selects go away. Is because yeah. I think uh, once option selects you go know, away, uh, Zerk favored, in my opinion. Yeah, I think so. I think so too. Oh, they've been um someone's someone's getting a back cap. Baron is pushing the back cap, and he's going to be. Are they going to do this gank properly? We'll see. He's already on half health, seventy percent now uh, revenge, maybe sixty revenge. Tags have dropped now. There we go. Okay, they actually did do it properly. Homker mm. comes out okay. against it, and he's getting caught. Man, I said Baron. I can't, I can't, I can't tell you. <laughs> like I can't tell you how badly I want that. Jeng Jun forward dodge heavy to be feignable. Yeah. Um, well, mistimed that. Goki gank. That should be. They're really tunnel visioning Homka there. I'm not sure they really needed to. They could have just left him at one health, right? And then rotated that push to C. That would have been. Yeah. I don't know. I mean, the rest of the team. Maybe at roughly the same time. Yeah the, yeah, the rest of the team on full health, and he could have killed himself fairly easily. So, would have just gone C, right? Yeah, they wouldn't have pushed C anyway. Well, I was saying if they if they maybe had like with one player at one health, is that enough time? Is that enough to push C? You push that then? I don't know. Just uh, the one. I mean, that two on like what seventy percent? Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. I also have a very hard time. Telling whether the push is a good one or not. Nice gank there. Very nice. I mean, they're behind Same on gank. points, so they need to get like some some foothold in the match in terms of points. Again, they're going backwards and forwards into mid and not pushing on C. But again, look, they got the kill advantage. Baron's not got a single one. Got renown advantage, but they're behind on points. And this is exactly how the last game went until about halfway and then and then there's something about the these guys 
Haven't guys managed to pull ahead on on points and renown and get and then finish them off. Yeah, but I think they really just don't want to push C. Yeah, I mean, I, they, they 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 don't. I think. Uh, I mean, maybe if they're confident enough uh, and say we're going to win the team fight here so convincingly and have them low and everything, then we can't push. Yeah. Or if they have to rotate too much, too yeah. often. Oh, no, it's a blue team. But yeah, I don't know. Just... I mean, now, not a bad time to push. You've got one low, one dead. Now, look at their health. Like, oh, yeah, you're right. They're just they're risking they're it as much. Their health is super low, yeah. But does JJ not have uh, off-target enhanced lights? Nope, he no, does not. Has, is famously bounces off everything. Yeah, I just Walls, saw that happen. Friends, allies, Flaws. opponents. Just, it is probably yes, one of floor. JJ's most <laughs> hated weaknesses. Because he's got the oh, big hitboxes, doesn't he? Yeah, yeah, he just hits So it's he hits very everything. easy for him to clip on. Oh, that, that is ballsy. Yeah, but according to you, I mean, Baron has been doing this the whole time. Chances. He's been doing these, like, back caps. I mean, and not. <laughs> he has been dying a lot to them, but um, he's stalling out the point generation, at least. That was a free parry there. Yeah, it should have been. And if you hit your ally, they can't. You can't peel for it. again. Missed time guard break. That would have um. That'd have been dead if you. It looked like a faint. Baron gonna fucking anti gank here. I mean. Mm. No. Okay. Well. How does this man keep finding himself not in his top? There we go. All right. Just is now on his tier four. Um... Hmm. Whoever was fighting mid all the time, they do a good job. Oh, I guess they died. Yeah. Well, now we're in a situation where, you know what I said last time about how the per the team that was ahead at 800 points was the one that <laughs> was losing. Um, they got to be careful here, because they might find themselves in that situation. Oh, we've got somebody... See, but then I also said that, hey, if you push A, if you push the home point at the same time, maybe that's the, hmm. the way to do it. Are you just giving that made them help, panic, right? I guess. Baron wants like, living eating, like, three attacks man. straight up. Pushing that tier four. So actually, <laughs> <laughs> this is a shite point. I yeah, know, right? Uh, like, just imagine, just imagine, like they'll make a new hero whose feats involve summoning uh, obstacles <laughs> next to you, so you can like okay. wall splat no, I don't like or concept. <laughs> <laughs> and this is looking super bad. For... Oh! <laughs> <laughs> yes, I took. He got up. Decided, you know what? Um, nah. Doink. But they need to get mid if they're not. This fla flask come out just like it's going down. Longbow hits <laughs> the floor. Uh, I don't know. Pillar? Walks the wall yeah. again. Walls, uh, Marischal's biggest enemy. But this is looking like it's going to be 2 0. I've got the Saints. Almost hit the wall again. Decided he had enough then. Um, yeah, Baron MVP, huh? Yeah, well, you know, I'm, I hate to say it, I told you so, but um, you know, I was saying that last time if they the one way to stop that happening when you have when you like it's about to go against you in mid is to push the enemy's home point and distract them from mid. That's exactly what happened, and then that's that let them win. Um, you think they're just too cautious in that regard? Because Baron died on the home point, right? But he stopped point uh, yeah, generation. He, like, he stopped yeah. them from healing for a long time, which allowed them to clear mid, which then allowed them to like keep mid while they respawn, and then the whole yeah. scenario unfolded like you told. Yeah, before. I mean, it's it's true. Well, so if you die on the enemy's home point, you give renown, right? I mean, that's the disadvantage. But if you're trading that off for an advantage on the rest of the map. 40 is 40 renown 40 renown loss worth you know 50 points in the in the rest of the game who knows 
Yeah, I mean, exactly. I mean, Who knows? <laughs> I mean, that's the calculation they're making, and then that's why they, uh, and then that's what they are trying to do. And and when it's working out for them, at least. We saw yeah, Baron enough. is extremely fond of back capping. He does that like in all these maps matches, especially Citadel. He's running, running back straight away. Uh, I think this might be the next match already. So this is two nil. If they this is tournament point, I predict we will see Baron run to uh, the back cap. <laughs> should we oh, should we get a get back going? Do you think who thinks he'll do it more than four times? More than four. Put me down for four. No, 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 three. I'm gonna go six. I was gonna go with six. three as well. Yeah. Okay, so Span, what do we get when he doesn't do it six times? Uh, you no. get a feeling of smug superiority. You know, I will. He has that, that all the time. He does have it all the time, which is why <laughs> I feel like it's a very safe bet for me to make. Yeah. 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 What do What do you gain here? Oh, well, I I gain the, the feeling of um, smug superiority then. All right, you're I'm, on. Because I'm incredibly humble and never, never normally have that. Yeah, it'll be those moments where he'll he'll get to wear that grime, you know, with pride. You know, he can gloat about it too. I too am incredibly humble. Yeah. <laughs> There's some certainty that I say I'm oh, the most God, humble man so. ever to live. I had the wrong. On the, on the, so the throne of Dr. Pepper, Pepper is not taken with ego. <laughs> Sorry, everyone. Uh, okay. One to A. And ah, that's wrong. The... And then we have a 4v4 in mid. That's just... I don't think we'll ever really see a different rotation then. Unless something massively changes in the in the way uh, like points give it out. The map gets changed for some reason because yeah. it's extremely large on this. A lot of damage going on both teams, here. really. This is quite fast for Team Fight Marichal's almost dead. Uh, Baron. The Baron's Moki saying. is is low. Homka is running around in. So. It doesn't count, Span. It doesn't count. It's not Baron. <laughs> Yo, I'm not saying it's Baron. <laughs> no, no, no. We said Baron, not the team. Yeah, we yeah, 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 no. the team. Yeah. Yeah, it has to be Baron. All right, that um, is a good push from. Yeah, it is. Uh, it is. It is. That was a good. Agree. Yeah. Like, oh, although. No, no, no. It's still fine. Still fine. Still fine. As long as he, you know, leaves. There we go. I mean, yeah. Stay a little like, bit longer. Like if two two more people came up there, then. Yeah, but then he might have thought he couldn't get out. What was that? I'll try. To do there. Just. Oh, did you see that target yes. sort of fucking deflect? That was dope. I mean, he, he died, but you know, that was still really cool. <laughs> he went out in style. Went out in top style. We have to keep an eye on Baron as well for this, uh, this bet to work. <laughs> yeah, just gonna very conveniently not look at him and say, oh, he back up. Ah, uh, the joys of not having anything at stake. That was some weird ladder fucker he went on there. I think yeah, we I mean, just the there. camera fucked him there, right? Uh, just die. Uh, oh, we're gonna get a kill here. I mean, he wants to leave, but oh, a Homka's doing it, he and he's going. I don't know about that push because he's gonna get respawned. Oh, there's. But they're getting one stopped. dead, one at one HP. If he could just stall it out, he's fine because he's gonna get reinforcements. Yeah. Oh, but their own team is also just one respawn, one low. Right, exactly. Eh. That's, that's yeah. what I meant. Uh, unlikely to get. Oh, Baron comes in. Does that count? No. No. <laughs> <laughs> Picks up two kills, though. Nice. Yeah. And then they can glad gank living. This is... Oh, that was bad. And no revenge tag on, on living yet. Yeah. It's so many demon bosses you So, yeah. Right living ganked himself, then. <laughs> That really was. I mean, like, a glad gank won't 100 over Goki without giving revenge if the Goki doesn't give them half his health bar beforehand, which is what he did. Should have zoned off that. Or target swap, like, yeah, something like that. And they get uh, more defender renown because he's a hybrid that got a kill.
parts. Ooh, damage coming out here. I mean, I mean they're gonna be stubborn here and stay on the point. They're gonna fight till the end. Yeah, yeah. The they're, 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 sensible to, they yeah. won't leave. They, they die. Or... Another missed time guard break. That would have been dead if they had timed that guard break properly. Rod looking really low, trying to bait people into the. Um... That's Rod dead, and the bounty hunter mm. proc. Oh, nice one from Marichal. Comes in, gets the kill. That's still a little bit too early. Just Ice is so low here. I missed time that dodge attack. That's the I mean, he got Defender Renown, but five just for him. That's a messed up gut. Um, go Key yeah, Kank there. Good. Baron's been doing really good. At... I mean, that was a free guard break. Um, yeah. In general, he gets away with a lot of uh, dodge lights. Yeah. And now they're pushing. Oh, someone's gone. Is that Rod's gone to push the the enemy home point? I think a sensible move here because considering how much they need to get one. Let's stop that. Bounce off Piper armor. Oh, bounced off. Hit stun. That should be dead, right? Mm -hmm. I think he would have got a hug for that and probably had the peel. Uh, maybe. I think it was a bit of fun. Living trying to get off and. Well, they actually ended up winning that push. This is looking real bad for Inconsistus. At least, at least Baron got this back up. Really uh, bad. That's too low, isn't it? Nice bait from that. That's dead. Yeah, I think a quick gank on this on Homka before anybody else shows up, but they did a long execution of the game to revive instead. Nice parry. Oh no, that's some, that's some dust guard. New clip, I always. Sorry, we can't do anything about this. Nice. Predicted the guard break option select and went for the heavy to get the kill. Good work. Okay, that was my PC. Let's see if Living can get. I think this all seems like might... desperation from them. Yeah, they might try and stall this out until. Oh, nice. nice kill. Fair enough. I mean, Living is in a really dangerous situation here. They're getting points slowly from mid. They've got about, I'd say, 30 seconds left before they push them into breaking. If they can keep living on this point at low health, they can get a kill into breaking, which Very stupid will be pretty chance. big. Sorry. Okay, they lost mid, so it's... Oh, good execution. This is, this is dead. There we go. And, uh, well done. We go. Yeah, that was actually... That was great. It was like seeing uh, a yeah, they, really, they really, really needed that. Like, that was well done. That's yeah. <laughs> but it's a still is an uphill struggle to. I well, I think none of us are going to get our bet because they because uh, they didn't actually take this point back again. <laughs> <laughs> to see Baron on the enemy points. <laughs> but but that was still like that was still worth the watch. You know, like that's definitely something to do like. <laughs> I mean, he's doing well for Renown as well. There's a tier 4 that just came out there. I think that was the... Um, yeah, I mean, now they've got a big point of advantage. The big feet of them. Marichal's bleeding <laughs> out. Get back up. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Does it count as a back cap if it's the, the home point? It's at the home um, point. Yes. Uh, it does. Okay. <laughs> I mean, still, it's, it's the enemy... It's, the enemy has the points, so yeah, it's the back half. Yeah, yeah, although it wasn't a back half because nobody was trying to get out there. Um, I mean, this is a weird situation for them to be in because, like, they have to rotate. You traded home points. Yeah. Fire Flask comes out. That was a weird one there. I don't think that was a good use of that. Yeah, fire neither I mean, did damage nor could the minions, right? Yeah, you, you, you want it to in front so the minions can't get in. Um, Living has got one pixel of health. Ooh. They got punished for trying to kill him. Wouldn't yeah. be surprised if that was, was, that was the back was, uh, uh, Ooh, Who did it? If, if, if that flask it was, it was a, a Raven flask. Not it wasn't a Raven flask, flask, I don't think. Okay. Um, nice from Just Ice brings it back. Still. Well, oh, it's getting close now. These guys, they could, if they all come back and hold it, there's a possibility they can force all breaking. Look who's on enemy points. 
<laughs> this counts. <laughs> Then goes down. Rod needs to be really able to survive this and get. Oh, uh, he's at a disadvantage of having. <laughs> oh my god! Wow. That's, that's yeah. That was actually pretty good. And he's at... he gets the bounty on the proc as well. Oh no, Rod! Oh, did you see that? That was a Raven Flask. That was a Raven. That was the Raven Flask. <laughs> yeah. That was a Raven Flask. One hundred percent. Nice deflect, though. <laughs> it just bounced off the wall in front of him. That's a real shame. I don't think... I mean... There we go. That's a 3-0. 3-0? Very Defenders convincing. I mean, these guys played last week and lost... It was close matches, but they did lose. Um, and they've really turned it up this week. Well, very yeah. convincing. Very convincingly. Um, yeah. I mean, like I said, the against Nam Gloria was it was uh, unpleasant to watch almost. <laughs> um, and they did really well here. A good, I think they I think they just out rotated these guys. Yeah. Um, Can't say it was just uh, a coincidence that they qualified. No, that was no, no, they well deserved. Good. Well deserved. Well yeah. deserved. I'm just, I'm. It's, it's a that's shame that's I think that the STD two didn't play this week because I because they played really well as well last week and I would like to have seen them. Um, the problem is I would have had to remember another name for the major because there's no chance it allowed that name. STD2. STD, yeah. Yeah, I guess so. I mean, there's some... Uh, if you look at the acronyms of some of the other teams, we've got some quite funny names as well. We'll yeah. see if... Uh, hang on, who was forced to change their name? It was a team name that was forced, right? Who was it? Um, was it an A team? Was, yes, it was... Zebra and Gizmo's team. It was, no, it was Gizmo's team that was called like something. Uh, it was something, something brains or something. something I, can't, I can't remember. I mean, I don't, it wasn't that extreme. Or anything. No, it wasn't. Like, that I'm bad. just saying if they were had to change. Well, maybe they say that it stands for like super. Uh, I don't know. Super trooper department. I don't know. Yeah, something like that. Yeah, um, two. <laughs> All right, so that is the <laughs> EU tournament done. We, we actually ended earlier this week than we have on previous weeks. Uh, I mean, sometimes we started finally at 11, and now it's 9.40. Yeah. yeah well, well, good. You know, the economy is, uh, you know, for most of you guys, you get to enjoy a rather quiet evening then. Yeah. Oh, not for yeah. me. They have me going to Guard Break Clash later today. Oh, wow. Good luck. Oh, that's going to be exciting. I'll look forward to... To that, or we'll see if we have um When does when does when does that start? Uh, God Break Clash starts uh for me in about three and a half hours. It took me a second. I'm gonna go with time. So that's basically the same time. That's uh, midnight for you. Yeah, where are you gonna be hosting it, by the way? No, okay. I'm not hosting it. Uh, me and Senka are participating. Ooh. Okay. Well, what can when can where can we see that? Uh, I mean, I guess you could just spectate me when it happens. I can tell you. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe. Um, but wait, I don't got... have a PC though, so like, I don't know how I can. Ah. Up their own. Uh, yeah, sorry about that. YouTube uh, or their own Twitch stream. I do have a Twitch. I don't know how it runs with four on though. The tournament, Gabriel Clash, have it. Um, they have their own place. They're 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 streaming their tournament. The guys who are running. I don't know. Let me check. I will look it up. The time yeah. collides with the announcement, right? Oh wait, yeah. wait, wait, uh, wait. Uh, so, who won the wager then? Well, no, no, nobody. Uh, I think nobody won. No, no, no. Okay, so this is where the uh, Jack Twitch TV dot Jack Hollow. Oh, sorry, Twitch TV slash Jack Hollow is where the uh, Garbrick Clash stream will. They're going to be streaming their tournament. Let me put that in. Wait, on the on which channel? I'll put it in voice text. Yeah, do that. Yeah, thanks. Appreciate that. And I think with that, we're going to give... Uh, we're going to take a break. Uh, is Norco Unless there's anything else you want to say oh. about... Um, is, anyone, uh, uh, is anyone from the NNK streaming already? Well, the NNK is almost... No, it's still two and a half hours out. So nobody will be streaming yet. I imagine Norgoz probably will stream it again. Clutch Meister might stream it too. 
he's currently streaming as well. We can, I guess, we wanted to throw people over. Um, let's see. Who it is. Um, Colchesterman. Norgos uh, isn't. I'll, I'll probably only, only, only I'll 14 of you, so clutch. you can choose where you want to go. <laughs> I'll go for uh, it. All right, job. Sure. Uh, and we'll all right, do well, a raid and then thanks, everybody, thanks everybody for watching. Um, Indeed. Okay. That's fine enough. Bye bye. Bye bye, everyone. Keep your sanity safe. <laughs>